Damn, I don't want to bust the cup in my ass. <laughs> <laughs> Pull a 187, yeah, bust the cup. 187 on the motherfucking car. We live, we live. I'm going to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh. We're going to turn to the east. All praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh. Bashim, Yahweh, Shah, Bashim, Kapodash. Shout out to Honor Squad, Honor Squad. Double honors to my apostles and elders, a great millstone who rule well, teach well, being a great example to his brothers, and peace and salutations to the hopeful elect and visitors scattered abroad. Okay, it's your brothers from the GMS Indianapolis camp and the GMS Bloomington camp about to go in. All right. The brothers. Okay, from Jim at Indianapolis, Jim at Bloomington. We're going to go into the prophecies, man. We're going to go into the scriptures. All right. Yep, hey, this is 2nd Andrews chapter 9, verse 1. He answered me then and said, Measure thou the time diligently in itself, and when thou seest parts of the signs pass, which I have told thee before, then shalt thou understand that it is the very same time wherein the highest will begin to visit the world which he made. That's right, man. So the Lord said, uh, measure down the time diligently. And how do you do that? By seeing uh, what's happening in the scriptures. Okay, the Lord planned it out. Okay, you go to Matthew chapter 24. The Lord said you're going to see signs, uh, wars and rumors of wars. Every single day, that's all we're seeing is wars and rumors of wars. Man. Wars, rumors of wars. Uh, people, uh, you know, men's hearts failing them for fear. Uh, it's, a, it's a heavy spirit of uh, anxiety, uh, anticipation. Uh, can I say, uh, what, what else? I, I don't know. It, it feels like people's hearts are failing them for fear. They're, 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 they're tripping out about this election. They, they, they feel like something is happening. They're anticipating. They're on their, they're on their, uh, the edge of their seat. The edge of their seat. You know, the Lord is ha uh, having a heavy spirit out here right now. You know, like I was mentioning earlier, man, you know, at work, man, you know, I can, I, I can hear it's like they're whispering. It's like, they don't want to say it out loud, but the elephant in the room needs to be addressed. Okay? The yeah. elephant in the room is prophecy, man. Yeah. All right? Let me grab, let me grab my script. Yeah. Go ahead, brother. Yeah, this is Ephesians 5 and 15. It says, See then that ye walk circumspectly, not as fools, but as wise. Right, circumspectly. Because the circumference around is speculating the book, all right? So when you walk a circumspect way, how are you going to walk circumspect? Built in your life through the scriptures of the Abashin Hashan, these laws that you have, all right? And understanding that what? We're in some evil times. Alright? The Lord is visiting this place, man. These people last in this home, especially when you saw evil stuff about white man, is Donald J. Trump, man. Which these people are about here to go vote for him right now. Yep. Right here in front of us. Yep. You know, the government place over here. Yep. Uh, these people are lining up, looking for their uh their paper mache. Uh, 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 leader, man. Uh, oh, shit. You know what I'm saying? That ain't gonna make it. Alright? These people ain't gonna make it, man. Look how they walking. Ain't gonna make it, man. Face down to the concrete. Ain't gonna make it, man. Precept. No hope. I got one, too. Right? And it says, and it says, not as fools, but as wise, right? Because we're paying attention. We're lining up the prophecies with the time we're living in. We're not in the uh, time of peace and prosperity, man. No. Alright? Uh, we're in the world hunger and peace. No. We're in war. Famine, death, War. destruction. Yeah. It's in everybody's heart. Yeah. Hey, that's yeah. all you see. That's yeah. all you hear all day, man. Yeah. I'm excited. Yeah. I'm excited about the prophecies, right. man. Hey, that's, hey, yeah. something about to pop off. Something is about to happen. I hope you know it. All right? Yep. So right here. Yep. But that's why it says, verse 16. Redeeming, yeah, right, the, redeeming the time because the days are evil. All right? And the days are evil. We're in the worst case scenario here in America, Babylon the Great, man. This is the worst that the earth has ever been in the condition under this wicked rulership, man, under Esau, even the so-called white man. That's why it says, Proverbs 29 and 2, when the righteous are in authority, the people rejoice, but when the wicked bears rule, the people mourn. Uh, uh, that's why we're saying when these people are walking around up and down, they're probably going to be in a state of happiness, all right? Or if they are a little happy, it's for the time being, man. And they force them. And they force them, yep. And, and the way they force it too, because they gotta stay lifted up. They gotta, you know, to try to enjoy this, man. They gotta put these false, well, it's gonna be all right in the back of their mind. You know what I'm saying? Well, Even though they see the the, the the walls caving in on them. Well, right? well, well, they got a lot of avenues to escape reality. Yep. It, it used to be the drugs. 
you know, different addictions. But then now it's like, oh, okay, well, you could go to the metaverse. You, if if real life so fucked up with you, yep. well, how about you just go to the to to an alternate uh, computer digital reality, yep. and you can be what you want to be there. Yeah, yeah, yep. Verse uh, seventeen it says, "Wherefore be be ye not unwise, but understanding what the will well, of the Lord said, is." Well, it says unwise means yep. stupid, so don't be yep. stupid. Right. Uh, well, Hosea four six, my people are destroyed for a lack of knowledge. All right, see, you have rejected knowledge. Uh, you shall be no, uh, I would. You shall, shall be no priest of me. Yeah. Uh, you know, uh, Their brother about to grab it. I'll grab it. Yeah. yeah. Hosea. What's up, bro? Yeah, I'll grab it. Yep. Might as well. It's Hosea, Hosea chapter 4, verse 6. And it reads My people are destroyed for a lack of knowledge because thou hast rejected knowledge. I will also reject thee. Right, right. so it ain't like... <laughs> go ahead, go ahead, brother. Right, because I was... <laughs> it's like, and, and who's the Lord's people, man? You need what's that team that's in that All right? We're the children of Israel. There's some water in there. You got right? some drink? All right, but you got to understand, man. All right, the Lord is dealing with you so-called Negro that's in that Those are under the curses that are at the bottom of, the, of these nations, man. All right? All right, we're the ones that destroy for lack of knowledge. You see our people, man. They go off into the ways of the heathen. They try to follow Esau, even the so-called white man. They follow his practices, and he still fail, man. Why are we failing as a nation? Because you're not chosen. You have by Shemel All right, you haven't chosen the path of righteousness. All right, we were made to be righteous. All right, not the wicked. But when you follow the path of the wicked, you're going you're going to stumble and fail because that was never our path to begin with. All right, so you're on a you're on a, 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 a unnecessary terrain that you would. That you weren't even prepared for. You weren't made to even handle that, man. You weren't built for that. You were built to be the righteous, all right? So that's why the Lord is saying, man, my people are destroyed for a lack of knowledge. Because if they truly knew who they were and truly knew what the consequences were for being the wicked, all right, they would they would straighten up. But since they don't, and then they refuse to hear, Ooh, they refuse. you know, they're going to have to be destroyed. They do this. It's yeah. Like, it's like a high yeah, yeah. pose. Oh, I don't want to hear the Lord's word. Yeah. Heisman pose yeah. to the Lord yeah, and his we, men. You ain't gonna get that Heisman trophy, man. It's gonna, it's gonna be wrapped in death, man. That's right. All man. right. Go ahead. Going back. It says Hosea four and six in the middle. It says it says, uh, I will also reject thee that thou shalt be no priest to me. Uh -huh. See, I will also reject thee, so be no priest to me. Go ahead. Seeing thou hast forgotten the law of thy power, uh -huh. I will law, also and the, and the law is life. Yep. Yeah. The the uh, the law, the statutes, laws, and commandments, and the knowledge that the Lord gave us, that's what, when you follow that, that's when you have the fullest experience in with, with the creation of the Lord. Right. You have it to, to the utmost. It's the best. It's, it's perfect. Everything is in harmony because everything everything works together, right? Yeah. Yeah. So if you live the way the scriptures tell you to live, now you are part of the ecosystem. Exactly. You work together with it. Everything works together. That's beautiful. Like Legos, man. Put it in, you know, it, it snaps together, man. But you're trying to take uh, Lincoln logs and combine them with Legos, it ain't gonna work. You're trying to mix water and oil, it ain't gonna work. Yep. All right? So it's got to match. Go ahead. It says, Since thou hast rejected knowledge, I will also uh, reject thee, mm -hmm. that thou shalt be no priest to me. Mm -hmm. Seeing thou hast forgotten the law of thy power, I will also forget thy children. Yep. So you and your children are going to be destroyed, man. All right, what? For the lack of knowledge, and then obviously you, you don't want it. All right, you love being a uh, Negro, Latino, and American. All right, you love being my, my, these my words. All right, you just want to be black. All right, you yep. just want to be boy to life. That's that's what you're saying. You know? Yeah. And you are, and you are, because in that mindset to just accept that I just want to be black, right? As opposed to color white. Well, guess what? Your ass is going to be destroyed, man. Alright, I'm going to go back to this uh, Ephesians. Back to Ephesians 5, verse 17 again. It said, Wherefore be not un be yet not mm -hmm. unwise, uh, yeah. but understanding what the will of the Lord is. And then you got the men, see, <clears throat> the average person don't know what the will of the Lord is, because the scripture says what? Uh 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 uh, they learned of me through the precepts of men yeah, or the yeah. traditions of men. Yeah. See, most people understanding of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, whom the world ignorantly calls the Most High God and Jesus, right? They only understand him through the traditions. Yeah. 
Right. You know, you go to you, your first Sunday, right? You had a communion. Easter. Easter Christmas. Christmas. You love everybody. Halloween, Thanksgiving. Uh, 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 hollow, uh, no, uh, hallelujah. We used to have it hallelujah yeah, night. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you come with your fucking costume in the church basement. Right. Which, which, whatever, but just, but you don't really understand what the Lord requires of you. Uh, Bible Kushal, grab Ecclesiastes 12 in the last verse. Because look, man, it, it, it ain't no gray area with the Most High. It's black and white. The Most High is a man, right? Men are, and he's the, he's the utmost of a, what a man is. Men are cut and dry. Go ahead, brother. This is Ecclesiastes 12 and 13. Let us hear the conclusion of the whole matter. Yeah, you want to go back and forth. You want to bicker. You want to blah, blah, blah. You want to get all philosophical and shit. Look, let, 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 let's simplify it. Yeah. Go ahead. It says, let us hear the conclusion of the whole matter. Fear the most high and keep his commandments. For this is the whole duty of man. So at the end of the day, that's what you're supposed to be doing. That's is simple, it's simple and plain. It's a hard thing for everybody, for these people to do it because... You know, they, they're used to the, they keep coming back to the fucking comfort level. Yeah. Yeah. You know, the Lord is about to take away your comforts in this world, man. He's going to take away your comforts, people. You know, these people think it's a joke to see the prophets. They want to take pictures and everything, but we're trying to warn you, trying to warn you, man, of the impending danger, man. Yeah. The Lord is about to destroy this place, man. Okay? And uh, we go back to 2nd verse 9 and verse 3. It says, therefore, when there shall be seen earthquakes and uproars of the people in the world. Oh, then, wait a minute. Yeah. Earthquakes, right? Yeah. You having earthquakes in spots where you would never uh, guessed it yeah. or assumed there would have been one. Yeah. Over there in, the, uh, 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 what is that? Missouri, I believe it's called the New Madrid Fault. Yeah. Yeah. Now, faults is, you know, you got different type of faults, right? And when 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 uh, those faults, you know, they teach you in school, right? Science and all that yeah. old shit. Yeah. When the, the, those faults are basically earthquakes would happen in those areas, yeah. and that's the Missouri would technically be the Midwest. Yeah. So when the last time you heard of an earthquake happening in the Midwest? Have we ever heard of that in our lifetime? Yeah. It's been a while. You hear about it. You hear about it through history. They said that we on the Madrid, or we on some kind of fault. Right? Yeah, yeah. 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 So we I think it's that one. The, 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 the new Madrid, the new Madrid fault. Yeah, new Madrid, some, new Madrid. Yeah. yeah. So these things are gonna. Hey, I've been in New Madrid. Ain't that something? Wow. I've been in New Madrid, in Missouri. The New Madrid, the, the New Madrid fault, man. Now read that again. Yep, it says, verse 3, 2nd verse 9 and 3. Therefore, when there shall be seen earthquakes and uproars of the people in the world. Right, because the earthquakes, is, is, is it's a whole bunch of earthquakes. Yeah. It's a whole lot of them. That's right. It used to be uh, you hear about a uh, CNN or oh, there's an earthquake happened over there in Malaysia or some shit. Right. But then if you go to the the, the internet, you would be like, damn, it's been there's been a, a, a two thousand earthquakes this year alone. You be like, well, goddamn, right, man, right, right. Yep. Rumble. And upwards of the people. In the and world. the average and the average American don't know that. Yeah. These people is just fucking dumb. Yeah. They're not paying attention to anything. Mm -hmm. You just look at them. He's just, you're a fucking idiot. <laughs> <laughs> they think they're so smart too. Yeah. But 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 that fear, that yeah. fear that they feel in their chest, yeah. with shit shit one like how I used to be yeah. with their mom, shit one like how I used to be with they with their grandparent, their yeah. great grandparent. Well, what that mean? Yeah. You on a fucking decline. Yeah. It's gonna be a change of world. It's gonna be a change of powers. America's about to be destroyed. That's right. Ain't no for, yo. Ain't no four hundred one k. And your kids ain't gonna fucking make it. You just go to school. They think fucking uh, college is the answer to everything. You just, right. We just gonna keep going to school. <laughs> you can't fight inflation with education, idiot. Right. You just gonna spend more to get it. You spend more money, <laughs> dummy. Then you gonna go into debt and never be able to pay it off because the missus coming. Yeah, all them fucking poor white people at the park <laughs> over there. Right. It's a fucking nice park. Yep. But you can't take your kids out there because all them fucking homeless po That's how you yep. know yep. America was yep. built for the good of the so-called white man. Yep. But now they walking around poor as hell. Yep. And you got so-called Negroes in position su supervisors yep. at the job. How you think they feel? Right. What, what, what do you think the conversation is when they go home and talking? Right. You mother they motherfuckers act like everything just all yep. fucking fine and dandy. Right. But they, their grandfathers and their fathers 
forward supreme, white supremacy. Right. So what you where you think they at? Yeah, they daughters might 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 like some BBC every now and again. Right. right. They still fucking racist. That's right. right. Go ahead, man. My bad. I done went off on the chance. Go ahead, man. man. Be that fire, bro. It says an uproars of the people in the world. Oh, wh- wh- now why would there be uproars of the people? Because they fucking they, 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 the pressure. Yep. There's pressure on life. Living life ain't never been this fucking hard, man. Right. It used to be you could go get a studio apartment, five, six hundred dollars, yep. right? What up? You making about five, six hundred dollars a week. Yep. Overtime, you make more than that. Yep. But now you get a studio apartment, that shit a thousand, fifteen. And and it used to be, oh, uh, that's just New York. That's just right. Florida. That's right. just California. No, your ass in Iowa. Yeah, <laughs> Iowa. Taking three checks to pay your rent. You know three what I'm checks, saying? man. And you still ain't been able to pay. You still two hundred short. Yeah, it's fucked up out here, man. Yeah, you know the way Esau got this place, man. It's just really yeah, like said, the, the squeeze is coming down. The squeeze, man. And people, are, that's what's going to keep keep these uproars going, and, and, and it's going to escalate. Especially this fucking election about to happen, man. Right. All right, this ain't over, man. It don't matter who's going to win. There's going to be some issues, man. Yeah. Oh yeah. You know. But that's what, but that's what's going to, that's going to help fuel the uproars yep. of the people. Yep. Because nine times out of ten, when there's uproars of the people, that's because they're not being properly led. The the, the laws are are too grievous. Yes. You know? And they coming with draconian laws. Yep. And when you look up uh, draconian, uh, Draco was a Greek lawgiver back in the day, and he known for and and, and, and Draco going to dragon as well. Yeah. Dragon. Yeah. And that word dragon yeah. going to the word cruel. Right? So the laws are getting more and more impressive. You have more and more rights taken away to where you look, what they talking about now ain't no middle class. Yeah. The middle class used to be like a very vital, a pivotal point in America. They used to have a little power. Yeah. They used to have to, as a politician, you would have to appease the middle class. But now they're getting rid of it, they just making it the super rich and the extremely poor. So that's gonna help fuel the, the uprisings of the people. Yeah, and I just seen an article where the, 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 the millionaires and stuff, the, their, their total wealth at, is about to uh, at eclipse the middle class. Because the middle class is a huge, it's a huge part. It's really the it used to be a big, of used to be a big class, yeah. yeah. It used to be the driving force of America. You know, the, the new companies, the upstarts, the, you know, the new innovation. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Ah, now, it, now it's all, it's, it's corporate greed. Like I said, now you have the ultra poor and the ultra rich. Like the rich is, they beyond rich. They beyond rich. Man, they got so much money. They, it's just too much money. You know what I'm saying? You don't know what to do with it. Man, about and then the poor, like you said, you see it. The dollars taxed to no end. You get taxed every time you exchange the money. It's like, damn, I'm paying taxes on the tax. I'm the tax. Well, with just in four years, right, the woman showed her grocery list from 2020. Yeah. And she showed her grocery list from 2024, and the price is doubled. So all these little youngsters thinking they got a future, man. They don't have a fucking future. Yeah. Their future is a, is a is gonna be a dystopian world. Yeah. With yeah. chips inside you, you're gonna yeah. be the computer. You're gonna be a damn computer. Yeah. And dystopia is the opposite of utopia. Is yeah. paradise. Yeah. The opposite of utopia is dystopia, where it's just utter hell. Yeah. You just a surf. You know you watch the old. You know you watch the old. Uh, the period pieces and shit. <laughs> You got the Lord of the Manor, right? Yeah. Then you got the fucking people working the field. They just they working hard in the motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> they ain't get nowhere. They, ain't get, they, they just work sun up yeah. to sun down. Yeah. Yeah. To eat a, a bowl of... <laughs> and they only eat, they eat meat. Right. They eat meat once a week. Right, right. Hot water and a, a potato wedge. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but, you know. Go ahead. Back to 2nd chapter 9. Verse 4. Then shalt thou well understand that the most high speck of those things from the days that were before thee, even from the beginning. Right? And that's right. All that's going down, Yahweh already laid it out. Alright? You get Isaiah 46 and 10. Right. You started verse 9, actually. Alright, everything was set up from the beginning. Now this they, this ain't this ain't this ain't a surprise. The Lord already put it out there. Everything was already written, it was already set up, and how it's gonna play out before the earth was created. Alright, so this ain't nothing new, and plus he put it in the scriptures, what's gonna happen. 
Now, it don't give us the, the turn-by-turn directions, per se, say, from all the events that are going yeah, to happen. Yeah, at 9.52, right. 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 November 5th. Yeah, well, right. since it don't say that, that can't be real. Man, shut the fuck up, man. Right. All right, no, that ain't. All right, that's why the Lord going to kill you niggas, man. Done. All right? You refuse to repent, and you refuse. <laughs> nigga ain't never heard that back. before. He ain't never heard that before. He ain't never heard that before. In Isaiah chapter 46, verse 9, it says, Remember the former things of old, for I am power, and there is none else. See, see, see they, right. forgot, they forgot about the Most High. That's right. We gotta, right. Didn't he flood the whole earth? Woo! Come on, man. Come on, man. He says, man. Remember the former things of old, yeah. man. Yeah. Yeah. Shit. And see, that's why he's got the prophets on the streets now, man, to re- to, to bring back to your remembrance who you got to play with, man. Huh. Yep. All right. Go ahead. It says, remember the former things of old, for I am power, and there is none else. Uh-huh. I am power, and there is none like me, yep. declaring the end from the beginning, yep. and from ancient times the things that are not yet done. Yep. And the Lord do that, so you ain't got shit to say. Exactly. You know, Jay, you know a nigga. Oh, I knew that. Nigga, no, you did. You know, that's a nigga. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I, I, I knew that. Oh, I knew. No, the fuck you did. Right, but you got hair down your back and Skittles flavors all over you. <laughs> like that dude. Yeah. Yeah, you seen him? I, I seen him. Her, 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 her Skittles. Yeah. yeah. They got a whole damn over there. Man, that bullshit, man. This place is stupid. Yeah, but you, like I said, Jake come up here and then he'll pretend to know all that. No, you don't. Because I can tell by the way you, you're moving out in the world. Go ahead. Yep. Declare the end from the beginning right. and from ancient times the things that are not yet done. See? From ancient times the things that are not yet done. Saying, my counsel shall stand and I will do all my pleasure. And how about Shemel is going to do all his pleasure, all right? It is set up by him for him, all right? He wrote the script, you know, he's the director, he's all that, all right? And we just play in our position, you know? We, got, we, just, we just pray that what? That, that our lot is what? For salvation, man. Everybody's in their lives doing what they're supposed to be. Everybody's doing whether it be good or evil. They're yes, doing sir. exactly what the Lord has set up to do. Yep. All right? Ain't and no Pro- free will. That's right. Proverbs 20 and 24 says what? Man's goings are under Lord. How then can a man understand his own way? Yeah, that's why their hearts are failing them for fear right now, yeah. man. All right, I got a precept. If I can bring it out, unless you want to bring it out, this is uh Luke, because you know, hey, you know this 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 voting ain't gonna help you people. Ain't nothing gonna help you people, man. The Lord's heart is on destroying America, man. Okay, and the signs, hey, this is Luke 20, 21 and twenty five, and there should be signs in the sun and in the moon and in the stars. Oh, signs in the suns and the moons and the stars. How many how many blood moons we had? Right. The Lord said he's gonna declare the things from ancient times of old. He told you he's gonna show you signs. Man. That's a man too. I know you got some. Oh, brother. Yeah, Sodom and Gomorrah. See, all out here too, brother. Yeah, so uh, 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 the signs and the suns and the moon and the stars. We had the eclipse, man. You remember that? Ooh, that was that was crazy looking, man. And, and we're seeing the frequency. Like I said, we've been seeing these blood moons and. Wolf moons, red moons, moons, they got all moons, fucking type of names. Yeah. 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 All of a sudden, you ain't heard nothing about this like your whole life. All of a sudden, yep. yeah, all, all these different moons and stuff. And it's back to back. It keeps happening. Back. Back. Yep. You no. Know, just like the Lord said, they shall speed things up for the elect's sake. Mm-hmm. You know, he's shortening the days, man. So and guess what? Yep. We're seeing the signs of the times play faster and faster as well. We're Ooh. seeing the prophecies pop up. All right. All right. All right. Go ahead. And there should be signs in the sun. And in the moon, uh-huh. and in the stars. Yeah, the, 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 the constellations is, uh-huh. is moving all type of crazy, uh-huh. right? Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> you know, they, uh, the, this planet aligned with this behind the moon, the, the planets aligning and all that type uh-huh. of shit, man. Now, we don't know exactly what all of those things mean, you know, down to the, the, the minute detail. Right. Uh-huh. But what we know is the Lord said, look, before that uh, great and dreadful day, those type of things are going to be happening. Right. And that's enough. That's it. That's it. Because it says what? More things are shown up to man than man can understand anyway. Exactly. Why did the Lord tell us that? Because we don't have to hone in on that. Well, we we got to make sure the constellation is this degree. No, we just know that there will be signs and times in the heavens that we're going to see it. So we should also know it's going to line up with what? The end is coming. The end is by. Yep. All right? Like you say, and that's it. All right? Yep. Other than that, we always go back to that question. What's it got to do with your salvation? 
Because Jake will go all super star deep nine on that stuff. All philosophy. Uh, 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 star deep, deep space. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Star they have all types of pack podcasts on that shit. Uh-huh. Right. <laughs> Moving into star. Brother, let's get, A million let's, views. Let's get into that. Let's get into that. How about stop eating fucking pork? Yeah. Get into that. We well, eat fucking shrimp crab. And we do these cigarettes. Right. All right. That, that's what y'all should be worried about. Worry about all the wrong things. Go ahead. Yep. And it says, and in the stars and up on earth, distress of nations. Mm-hmm. Oh, these Ooh. nations, these nations catching hell, man. Oh, man. Whether it be the natural disasters that the Lord bringing, yep. whether it be the unnatural disasters that Esau bringing with his heart. Yep. Right. Whether it be just be being under Esau's uh, rule and thumb, yep. wanting to rise up, the, the nations are distressed, man. And then look, and it's still, even, even with that, it all goes to God, my shit outside. He gets all the glory in there. This movie, go ahead. Right. It says, in distress of nations, it says, uh, with perplexity. Woo. Motherfuckers confused. And like how you said, if there's a. Uh, you said uh, there's anxiety, yeah. there's anticipation, yeah. and then you said, help me out, it's another word. But well, that's the other word. That's yeah. the word. Perplexity. <laughs> Motherfuckers perplexed. Let me get that real quick. Please, please. Because the Lord ain't, look, look. It ain't no future in your front. That's an old right. song that's right. by Bootleg <laughs> from Michigan. Yeah, yeah, ain't no future, future for you, man. Yeah. That's why everybody confused. See, motherfuckers used to walk around proud as hell. Yeah. Oh yeah, America got the strongest. Uh, blah blah blah. Right. You planning trips and shit. Yeah. Now your ass scared. You don't know yeah. what to now expect. You, you don't you know what the future gonna bring <laughs> for your grandbabies. Right. <laughs> you can put the blame on us though, because that's what they always do. When you look at history, they always blame the Israelites. Yeah. No, you fucked the world up. Yeah. You so-called white people, y'all won the world. Yeah. yeah you yeah. wanna blame Kamala and blame Barack? Well, how, well, how many? Well, who the fucking senators? Right. Who the House of Representatives? Right. Yep. Who the congressmen? Right. The majority of them is fucking white people. That's right. right. So how about you blame yourself? Right. <laughs> wow. We shaking a hand out here, man. I got perplexity. People want to look at us like we the problem. No, man. We're not in the power seat. We at the bottom. Alright, we know we're you already kick us while we're down anyways. You know? But that's hey, that's all right. Hey, cause hey, blood, hey, let's see that persecuted for the Lord's sake, man. From yep. the paraphrase. For the name of Yah Bashmel Shah, that's fine, we'll take it. Alright, y'all looking at us all crazy and traffic and shit like that. I'm looking at them like they fucking crazy. Yeah, right. Man, this motherfucker walking around yeah. like the wicked witch of the fucking east or right. some shit. Uh, you fucking crazy. Right. Probably got 50 crystals in that fucking bag. Man. Yeah, fucking cat hearts. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Fucking puppy paws. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I got that word perplexity. Rabbit shit. Yeah, rabbit foots. Yeah. It says bewilderment. Read that. Bobby, should I read that again? It says men's hearts. Uh, slack it. We're going it perplexity. Says, it says distress of nations with perplexity. Right, perplexity, bewilderment, mm-hmm. doubt, yeah. uncertainty. And confusion. Woo! And if you got a, and if you got a fucking fraction of a working brain, and, and that's how you should feel right now. Yeah. The only people, the only people that's fucking sure-footed is the those in the truth. That's right. Y'all don't believe in this. If, if you got a working, if you got a piece of a working brain, and you paying attention to what's going on, that's how you feel. That's right. Doubt, uh, confused, yeah. bewildered. Yeah. Don't know what's, go, don't know what the future holds for your ass. Right. Because you don't know. We telling you. Yeah. Look, yeah. look, look, it's, it's over. You don't want to accept that it's over. Right. Because you got your investments. Yeah. You know, you got, you, you know, I'm going down with the ship. Right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> In the Titanic. Right. Right. We, we, we plant, they the band and shit. Right. Like, yeah, fuck yeah, it, we yeah, going with... still playing all the way down that motherfucker. Well, that's a beautiful yeah. example. Yeah. The brother brought out the Titanic. What, yeah. what did they say about Titanic? What did they say about the Titanic? It would never go down. They said not even the God, most hacking. They said not even God could sink this shit. Woo. Proud as hell. And that's what America thinks. Yep. That this is a that's what chills in me, man. Yeah. You see? That's yeah. the spirit, man. Yeah. Woo. Hey, man. They think that, hey, and, 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 and the Lord is going to come as a thief in the night. Yeah. See, everybody real proud, but hey, everything is going to get wiped yeah. away. Okay, like the North Carolina floods, man. Ain't nobody going to help your ass. Yeah. Okay, the Lord is going to be laughing. His angels going to be cracking up, giving high fives. Yeah, I got his ass. 
Yeah. Hey, the scriptures say the, uh, the, 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 uh, uh, what's that in, uh, Sirach 39? Hey, there be spirits that are created for vengeance. Yeah. They get happy, man. Yeah. Wearing your ass out. Yeah. They yeah. get happy. They're like, yes, I got him. Yeah. Yeah. You yeah. know? Yeah. Got his ass, man. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I did my job. Yeah. What's next? This is a. Uh, I got a quick preset, real quick. All right. This is Ezekiel 33 and 33. And when this cometh to pass, lo, it will come. This shall we gotta read that slower. Yeah, we gotta read that a little like, slower. Ezekiel 33 and 33. And when this cometh to pass, lo, it will come. That doesn't say, do you? Lo. <laughs> lo me, look. Yeah. You know how Jake talked by like, look, bro, look. Yeah. I'm telling you. Yeah. It's going to happen, bro. All right. Then shall they know that a prophet hath been among them. All right? So the Lord going to put back in your remembrance all the sitting in traffic, listening to us, laughing, take, taking pictures, take taking pictures. videos. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Looking like we, like we foolish. No, nah, y'all going to find yourself foolish in that day, man. Because the Lord going to put that back in y'all remembrance, man. Damn, that's what they, they were saying that. And this just happened. Like, <laughs> what was his name? Uh, your, your who's your they ain't gonna get it yet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, yeah. The Lord gonna uh, make their mouth stop. He's yeah. gonna, he ain't gonna let them formulate his name. Nah. Nah. Be and even if they do, he ain't gonna hear it. Right. Because uh, when you read Psalm, oh. it says, uh, what was that, Psalm 18? <laughs> when, when David beat his enemies up, he said, they cried. Even to the Lord. Right. <laughs> but I beat their ass. Yeah, I beat roughly their paraphrasing. <laughs> yeah. So even if you get the name right, that don't mean nothing. <laughs> because the, the 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 name of the Lord, it ain't just a syllable. It's a it's a reputation behind that. Yep. Behind behind the sound that they make. Oh, real quick. Go ahead, I Proverbs twenty eight nine. He that turneth away his ear from hearing the law, even his prayer shall be an abomination. See? Your prayers even a filthy wicked act to the Lord, man. Because he, while you yet had liberty, right? You had a time of a place of repentance, right? You despised it, man. So now, now when the Lord put it back in remembrance, and you may remember tonight, oh, my cousin did tell me that you're right, 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 right. But you were a wicked ass nigga the whole time when you had a chance, man. Yep. But now the Lord put it back in remembrance, but it's too damn late, man. To it's apologize. Too late to apologize. <laughs> to apologize. <laughs> It's too late. Yep. You know what I mean? That's gonna happen to millions of you, Jakes, man. Billions. All right. And hey, 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 like McDonald's say, we serve billions and billions. Billions serve. Billions serve. Hey, the, the, the scripture, man. The Lord. Billions serve, man. All right. It is through the word, man. Yep. All right. The, old, the scriptures say that lion went out through the ends of the earth. Right. That's right. It's the real fast food, man. That's Esau right. think he got something on the Lord. No, this uh, word, this food right here going out every single morning, every yeah. single night. It, it ain't no way that you ain't heard the name of the Lord. Right. Don't sit here and try to tell me you ain't heard your high by Shimmy Yahweh That's right. Yep. Yeah, it is. Man. We're in the co- one of the major colleges in the U.S., Bloomington, Bloomington, IU Bloomington over here, right? Yep. All right, and these people come from all over the world to come here, man. Yeah. They're seeing it. Yeah. They're catching the name. They're catching the judgments. Why are we doing exactly what the Lord said we're going to do, man? Prophesying unto these nations. Yeah. Man. Yeah. Yeah. It's happening. They got to hear the judgments. Go ahead. Yeah. Going back to St. Luke chapter 21, at verse 26, it says, Men's hearts fell in them for fear. Mm. And your heart, your, your heart fell in you for fear Ooh. because what, what, what's your heart? Your mind. Yeah. Now, what is fear? Somebody grab Wisdom of Solomon 17. Uh, is it 17? Is it 17 and 19? Because we're gonna show you what fear is through the yeah, scriptures. Yeah. Wisdom of Solomon 17 and 12. Wisdom of Solomon chapter 17, verse 12, and it says, For fear is nothing else. But a betraying of succors, which reason offer it. Right. So your fucking what you think is right and how you think things supposed to go, you're gonna be betrayed. Cause it ain't gonna go like that. Uh, it's gonna be your your fucking mind ain't gonna be able to fathom and perceive what's in front of you. That's right. And when and when when that type of shit happened, that's the what they say, what's the greatest fear? What they say? The greatest fear is the fear of the what? Uh, the, the unknown. The unknown. The unknown. Because everything that you get, your mind, where you can pull, you can pull from to to to, to make sense yeah. of reality, is uh, not gonna is not gonna be made sense yeah. of. Woo! 
Yep. Wit, wit shall hide itself, man. Yep. Going back to the That's future. It. Yeah. Second Edges chapter five, is it? Yeah. Yeah. Wit, man. That you go into that word wit. That means understanding too. Uh, if I'm yeah, yeah, yeah. Wit, wit, wit. You know how people say you witty, you yeah, witty. Yeah, witty. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because you know, because the, the so-called white man, they think they got it. Yeah, yeah, they think they got the keys to life. Well, yeah. this is what you're doing. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Yeah. But the Lord said, uh, grab uh, Sirach 19. Because his light is a light of wickedness. Yeah, see, like, see, you can make it with wickedness up until a point. Right? Yeah. Jake know all. Jake know how to cut the dope and, 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 and you know, break it down. And mm-hmm. Jake know how to rob. And Jake know how to uh, crack cards and all. But all that shit got to seal it. Uh-huh. The knowledge of wickedness is not prudence. Yep. Uh, what is that? That's the rock nineteen. Uh, that was a uh, nineteen and uh, oh, that was. Like, I think it's uh. Yeah, I got twenty two. Okay, but I'm gonna start up. Uh, yeah, yeah, but wherever you feel. I'm gonna start eighteen actually. Okay, it's like the rock nineteen and eighteen. It says, "The fear of the Lord is the first step to be accepted of them, and wisdom obtained is his love is is." Lo- Obtained his love. Yeah, so, wisdom obtained his love. Uh-huh. If you want the most out of the most out of just don't fucking love you, bro. Right. <laughs> right. Like he what the fuck? Wrong? Wrong? <laughs> the, 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 the wisdom of Solomon says the most I love of none except he that dwelleth with wisdom. That's right. right. He don't just fucking love you because you exist. Right. So you can live. So you can be a fucking. So you can live like Pamela Anderson in America. Right. Uh, so you can walk. So you can walk around and do, you walking around doing rod, right? All right. So you fucking you walking around, right? Being a fucking free spirit. I am a free spirit. Having orgies and shit, right? Uh, fucking uh, being a homosexual. God don't love you. And when do you fucking gays start believing in God? I'm tired of you fucking faggots, homosexuals, dykes. Talking about God in the Bible. I, it, it used to be back in the day, if you was gay, it was a, by default, you didn't believe in God. Right. Now you fucking faggots religious all of a sudden. Con. Now you want to talk about Make that life. make sense. Make it make sense. <laughs> fucking having you fucking bi curious women over there. Yeah. Having your oh. little having your little college experience. Yeah. Licking carpet. Yeah. <laughs> Calling yourself a worshiper of God. And the demons, man. Yeah, yeah let the like, demons, yeah, turn up. Turn up. Turn up. <laughs> turn up. Turn up. Uh, Go ahead, man. <laughs> but see, that's perfect, though. Perfect. That's yeah. perfect. We love it. Verse 19. The knowledge of the commandments of the Lord is the doctrine of life. Yeah, see, yeah, that came out earlier. That's, how, that's the doctrine of life, man. That's how you. That's how, you. You have the best experience on this planet yep. with the with the with the laws of the Halabash and Yahweh Shai, man. Yep. Yep. And they that do things that please them shall receive the fruit of the tree of immortality. Yeah, you gonna you gonna you gonna get the uh uh uh, uh delivered that first go round, man. Yep. Those that do things that please the Most High, they gonna be they gonna get the first dominion, man. Yep. Right. Ain't life that? ain't life hard already? Right. You motherfuckers walking around dirty. Yep. <laughs> yeah, these people stink. Yeah. Especially yeah. white folks. Yeah. <laughs> well, 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 they don't wash up. They just wash their hair yeah. and they get the soap. They wash up like <laughs> once a week and shit. <laughs> they make they and they make fun of us for having wash rags. Right. <laughs> Motherfucker, you gotta scrub. Right. You gotta scrub that right. shit. <laughs> Hey, I seen yeah. a video of one white lady. She said, "Wait, I don't wash up but uh, once a week or something like that." Yeah. I'm like, "What?" Yeah. Oh, oh, the one lady's like, "Yeah, I, sh- I take a shit in the shower. Like that's a normal thing." Oh like, hell, what? y'all! <laughs> Why are you showering? <laughs> what? Oh man, yeah. I never even thought I'd hear something like that. You wouldn't even think because that's when, hey, see, that's the wicked. Yep. You yeah. know what I'm saying? The they're basis, born the, the base basis. of men. They, and they're born the to be men. wicked. They vile in the earth. Hey, that's why white women. That's why so-called white women, when they get with the the so-called black man, the so-called Latino man, the so-called Native American man, they love them. Right. They, they, we're cleanly, ra- we're, we're much more clean race. Right. We're cleaner. Yeah. We use wash rags. That's right. We, you, need, you need fucking abrasion to be clean, dummy. Right. <laughs> cold water don't count. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they do all them fucking drugs. They get all them big-ass red pimples on their face, yep. drugged out, yep. stinking. Yep. 
Now, I'm going to talk about you today. How you doing? I like I like you guys' banter. <laughs> I like your beard. He got a nice yeah, he beard. Came, he, came back, he came back. He came by uh, a, few, a few weeks ago. He, he said what's up to him. Well, at the, at the end of the day, it's, it's not really banter. It's just the Lord. You know? Yeah. It's truth. It's truth. Yeah. It might be a little, it might be a little, you know, yeah, there might be a little yeah, comedy yeah. in there, a little comic yeah, yeah. relief. Yeah, yeah. But, uh, but, 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 uh, uh, ain't no lie. Yeah. Ain't no lie about it. Hey, uh, because, hey, hey, because all good jokes <laughs> contain <laughs> true shit. Yeah, 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 you know yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Verse 20. And jokes on you. Yeah. Yep. The fear of the Lord is all wisdom. Oh my God! And in all wisdom is the performance of the law. Right, that's all. <laughs> this is the oh my, come on, come on now. All wisdom is the performance of the law. The law is good. What's that? Romans seven. You ain't gotta get it. It yeah. says the law is good. And the knowledge of his omnipotency. Of his and then, uh, uh, um, 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 omnipotency. Mm-hmm. Have you said? Omnipotent. This is all power. Cause you know the Lord. Look, look what it says. Uh, fear of the Lord is beginning to wisdom. Yep. Oh my God, He control everything. We gonna fall. We gonna listen to Him. We gonna listen to him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's right. Oh, oh, He's the designer. And the, oh, okay, yeah. Oh, He's the author and the finisher of our faith. Yeah. He infinity. Right. He infinity and O. Right. We gonna listen to Him. Yeah. That's right. Straight up. Yep. <laughs> Verse twenty one. If a servant say to his master, I will not do as it pleases thee, though afterward he do it, he angereth him that nourisheth him. The knowledge of wickedness is not wisdom, neither at any time the counsel of sin is prudence. Yeah, the counsel, you know, g- niggas get yeah. together. Look, this how you do it. Look, yeah. right? Yeah. Niggas show you how to pimp. Yeah. Yeah, I done heard stories, man. Dudes done had girlfriends that really was into them, and they talking to older dudes for guidance. And the older dude to give him information how to pimp it. Look, this is yep. what you do. You do like what? <laughs> you trying to get some money instead of teaching me how to fish? You, you, you know, when yeah. you want money to sustain yourself, you don't mm-hmm. teach me how to fish. You teach me how to rob. Right. That's right. a song, right? Man, you heard that song? Yeah. Teach me how to rob. Yeah. I think it's Gucci, yeah. Gucci yeah. Man, or something, yeah. right? Yeah. Something like that, yeah. The knowledge of wickedness is not prudence, nor the the counsel. Read that again. Yeah. Well, this is uh, Ecclesiastes 19, Ecclesiastes 19 and 22. The knowledge of wickedness is not wisdom, neither at any time the counsel of sinners prudence. Yeah, 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 you women out here. You yep. get all this knowledge and information from your mama and grandmothers yep. telling you, oh, that's just puppy love. It's going to be right. many. Go out there and play in the field. <laughs> What's the end result of that? Right. Your ass fat, lonely, and through. That's mm-hmm. right. 30 different baby daddies, you know. That's, that's the answer. 50 years old, still out here. Yep. Still look, when I was young, look, look, when, look, when I was young, my grandma, but my grandma wasn't, you know, my granddad died or whatever. My grandma went out here playing the field in her forties. Nah. She was a grandma. Yeah. She was already in grandma mode in her forties, yeah. bro. Yeah. These women be out here forty, yeah. thinking they what they say is the new twenty. Yeah. Yeah. Motherfuckers believe that shit. Yeah. You got four. You got fifty year old women walking around, and I'm saying this because this is what I've seen. Yeah. You got fifty plus year old women walking around with color hair, yeah. leggings, and Jordans. Yeah. yeah. With their ass showing with some tights on. Still playing the field. This is a... Can I give a yeah. precept? This is the book of Proverbs, chapter 14 and 12. It says, There's a way that seemeth right unto a man, but the end thereof are the ways of death. And that's mm-hmm. pretty much what you're saying yeah. right now, what we're yeah. going into. Yeah. You know, everybody, uh, you know, they think they're going the right way, but they're actually going the wrong way. You know, it's a it's a it's a bizarro world if you think about it. If that, whatever that means, yeah, 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 yeah. world it's backwards. Everything is upside down. Uh, you know, like when you think about the children, what they're pushing on the children, and and everything that they want for their future, it just feels like you know, hey, like the the, uh, the righteous man is not going to be around. They don't want nothing about the Lord. They don't want nothing about. Uh, masculinity, they don't want nothing about nothing, man. So they just want women to rule. Second one is six and twenty eight. No, no, keep talking. Now. They don't they don't want they don't want nothing to have to do with uh righteousness, man. Okay? They just want to be in the dark. Keep us in the dark, shut the motherfucking blinds. Don't Isaiah the blinds Isaiah twenty nine. Keep the damn blinds down. Don't wake me up. I love this shit. Well guess what? That's gonna be your death, man. Isaiah what is that? Prophesy smooth things, prophesy lies. Isaiah thirty. 
Is that 29 yeah, 31? Yeah, probably 30. 30 like, uh, 9 or 10 or something? Yeah. This is Isaiah chapter no, 30. No, no, this is what's like. Let me get the second of 29. Uh, 28? 28. Uh, yeah. True, flourish, faith. Yep. Uh, this is 2nd Isaiah 6 and 27. It says, For evil shall be put out, and deceit shall be quenched. And that's what's happening, man, through the yep. truth. All right? Because evil and deceit have been running the earth. Yep. <laughs> Esau, Edom, the Illuminati, right. their wisdom is evil and deceit. But the Lord says the knowledge of wickedness is not prudence. So that's all that shit got a fucking expiration date. Right. And that's where we at that's where we at with it. Yep. That shit is expiring. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Esau's trying to freeze the kingdom, trying to hold it longer. Right. We, passed the, we passed the fucking expiration date, you right. know. What I'm saying? Well, let me see if I can preserve it a little bit longer. No, man. That means they, fall. Yeah. That's why they hold kicking the can down the kicking street the can. to try to keep this financial thing going. Yep. Nah, man, it's about to be over, man. The Lord, hey, the Lord's about to uh, close this down. We're about to see the credits roll here. So. <laughs> Verse 28. Second Andrew 6 and 28. As for faith, it shall flourish. Yeah, and then who got the faith? The hopeful elect. That's right. And it's flourishing. It's getting yeah. greater. It's building. Yeah. Because as the prophecies happen more and more, what the scripture says, uh, 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 real quick segue, I read it real quick. The scripture speaks about when the power of the Most High is expressed his servants get emboldened this is a uh, wisdom of solomon 12 and 17 for when men will not believe that thou art of a full power then you niggas don't believe in the most high mm -hmm. you don't believe he you don't believe he flooded the earth and i'm gonna tell you something sedimentary rock only comes from water Come on, and you man. have sedimentary rock over the whole face of the earth now Ooh. what can do that right it wasn't a fucking ice age. Ice age, yeah, bullshit. Right. Yeah, the most I flooded this bitch. Ice age. Yep. It wasn't a fucking ice age. Yep. The most I flooded this earth for the wickedness of it. Yep. It says, For when men will not believe that thou art of a full power, thou showest thy strength. Yeah, niggas be, niggas be kicking it. Yep. And the Lord just allow you to kick it. And at that, that, that last little moment, that's when he show himself. It says, and among them that know it, among the believers that fear the most high, thou makest their boldness manifest. So we get turned up even more on your ass. That's right. Yep. And that's why we're standing what? Bold is lying right now in the face of our oppressors, man. Nah. <laughs> There's three of us, man. Versus the whole world right here at this point, man. It's just us who gets the world, man. Yeah, you know? Hey, everybody like an underdog story, man. That, that's what we are. We got every movie, man. bro, every movie, book, every whatever the fuck is an underdog story, yeah. man. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Second uh, six and twenty-eight. As for faith, it shall flourish. Corruption shall be overcome, and the truth which have been so long without proof shall be declared. Yep. And you see the truth being declared, man. That you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American are the children of Israel, man. All right, we're the people of the Most High, man. All right, that we're under the curses of Deuteronomy 28. That yep. we fit them, and we fit them. All right, the people over in the land with the small hats, man. They're not the people, man. All right, them niggas wear underwear until they fucking disintegrate on. You mean to tell me that's a, come on? There's right. only that's, one God, and that's His people, right? A fucking non-hygienic. What? <laughs> we. Crunched over. That doesn't even make base, sense. Base is hell. Up in the walls. Yeah. Under ground tunnels and shit. Coming out the tunnels with trafficking right. baby. All in a tunnel with the babies. Right. Yeah, they, they would have found the pillows and mattresses. Blood and stains. Blood yeah. Fucking yeah. high chairs. Yeah. Feet. What you feeding the babies? Right. They ain't said nothing about that ever since that happened. Yeah. We ain't heard about no charges. It's nothing. Yeah. But you damn devil's going down, man. <laughs> <laughs> but see, it's being declared now. It's being declared. We stand here bold telling y'all, man, America's going to be destroyed via what? Thermonuclear destruction, man. Y'all wasting your fucking time going to school. All right? You ready to, hey, you ready to bow down to your new masters, man? That's what's about to happen, man. Yeah. Right. Isaiah, chapter 13, and 2, and it says, Lift you up a banner upon the high mountain. Mm -hmm. Exhaust the voice unto them. Yep. Shake the hand that they may go into the gates of the noble. Right. Now, how that is being posted, man. Yeah, you're high my shot right here. 
the highways of heaven, man. All right? Because that's the foundation of it all, is the name. Yahweh, why Yahweh Shah? Yahweh meaning he is or he exists, who the world calls God. Yahweh Shah, which means he saves or he delivers who the world even calls Jesus, man. Because the letter J didn't come till 1524, so you know it wasn't Jesus. Right. right. All right? He's a Hebrew. All right? Not only is there no J's in Hebrew, it ain't a, that, right. that, the letter, it, that, there's no J in a lot of languages. Nope. So where the fuck you get Jesus from? Right. It ain't no J doesn't exist in a lot of languages. Nope. Not just English, not nope. just Hebrew, well not pardon me, not just Hebrew, not just Spanish. Nope. J don't exist in a lot of languages, man. They hide, man. I mean, that's Esau, he, uh, Vagabond and a what? Yeah, uh, yeah. Fugitive and a Vagabond. Sure. That motherfucker been running, hiding up on the shit. He put, put this rock on me. Right, right. Go into this cave. Right. Get behind the car. Yeah, yeah. Do this. Put, some, hey, put hey, a cover hey, on me. Hey, hey, Do hey, something. Right, 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 right. Oh, hey, what are they I don't want them to know who I am. Hey, you, know, you, lift up, you, know, you know you lift up that rock, you see all yeah, type of, you see the roly polies, the centipedes, you see all type of fucking bugs, <laughs> crickets. <laughs> That's Esau, baby. Your ass is uncovered, boy. Yeah. Hide everywhere. The scars have been lifted. All right, we All right. Yeah, and their enchantments ain't gonna be working too much anymore. They ain't working too much anymore. Right now, man. Let's change. You want me at twenty nine or thirty? It's thirty nine. Yeah, nine. Yeah. It says Isaiah 30 and 9. And uh, I'll start at 8. Yeah, hey, eight. Yeah, we're right. it says right on the yeah, it says, yeah. Now go, write it before them in the table, and note it in a book, mm -hmm. that it may be for a time to come forever and ever. Right. So, so, oh, yeah, that, it's in these scriptures, right? All right? The time of ever, all right? Because this, this is living water. All right? It ain't, uh, oh, this that's old talk. You know what I'm saying? That's back in the day. No, this is living water. This is current. It's, it's a right. current book. It's a current book. All right? Living it it was relevant yesterday, and it's relevant tomorrow. Oh. It's relevant today. All right? Go ahead. Verse 9, Isaiah 30, verse 9, that this is a rebellious people. So we gotta be. So we gotta. We gotta. We gotta record this. Yeah. These niggas rebellious. Right. We gotta write this down. Cause if you don't, if you don't record shit, Jake act like it didn't happen. Right. Yeah. No, nigga. We 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 got your number, nigga. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> from back then to, right. to we we got you from all the way back then to now. Yeah. All the way from Egypt. Yeah. This is a fucking rebellious people. Yeah. All the way from Egypt to Judges to all the way in. Moses, Samuel, all of it. To this day. To this day. And you see, you see Negroes out there in Latin America, the hard headed to the mud, man. Mm -hmm. You see why we're the, you know we the people of the book. Look how we act. <laughs> Look how we continue. That's why the Lord said if these works would have been done in Sodom and Gomorrah, they would have repented. Yeah. If these was done over uh over here, they, yeah. they would have repented. Yeah. No, you niggas is you niggas is hard headed. Yeah. You niggas of a a bun. Live. <laughs> <laughs> that means a hard heart. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, rock! No, no, it means rock hard. Rock hard. Yeah. Fucking rock hard, yep. man. Yep. <laughs> hey, they said they made their heart an adamant stone. Adamant stone. Mm -hmm. Right, because they don't want to listen, man. Yep. All right. Adamantium, Wolverine claws, yep. right? Yep. Adamant for the uh, real hard yep. metal. You niggas, man, can't get through to you niggas. Yeah, that's why I said it when Isaiah, the first chapter, he said, he said, why should I strike you? You just revolt more and more. You know the kid, you know the bad ass kids. You just send that nigga to reform school. Yeah, like, you know what I really want to say. I'm going to end up killing him. <laughs> right, 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 right. Yeah, like, you just send that nigga off to reform school, yeah, man. Yeah. The switch ain't helping. Ain't nothing helping. Yeah. <laughs> it's up. Uh, you done braided the switch? Yeah, you done right. braided and everything. Right. He's an ass fruit. No. Right. He's still, he's still messed up. Yeah. It says that this is the rebellious people, lying children, children that will not hear the law of the Lord, uh -huh. which say to the seers, see not. And we're the seers, man. What is a seer? Yeah. Okay? Right. A seer is a prophet. Yeah. But the seers see the future yeah. and tell you, now what you want? It's like inside trading, right? Yeah. Don't you want a motherfucking... Uh, uh, yeah, like a... You know, hey, help me out. The hands, hands up? up? Yeah. That's what it is. We got inside of trading, yeah. man. Yeah. Look, look, look. If I was you, I would take my eggs out that basket. Right. You know, 
and put it in this basket because this the one. Yeah. Right. That's what the truth is, this man. Is put, it your, money, put it in your house shy. Yeah. yeah, put your. I, I'm telling you, but I'm telling you, <laughs> hey, your house shy. Hey, that's, that's <laughs> hey, hey, couple years you're gonna be brother shit. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Just come right here. You yeah. know. Right. Yeah. Beautiful. Mumu guy pan. They not Chinese though. <laughs> <laughs> That's a, di- that's a dish, actually. Yeah, right. <laughs> Go ahead. It says, uh, Isaiah 30, verse 10, which say to the seers, see not, and to the prophets, prophesy not unto us right things. You ever told somebody the truth and they said, no, no, no damn it. Don't tell me I'm about to go turn up. <laughs> <laughs> now, now I don't want to go out. Yeah. Now I don't want to go out. You, know, you, know, you know the Lord said you can't smoke a cigarette. Ah! It's like putting garlic on a vampire. Right. <laughs> I'm melting like we can to the we- right. but the but the, but the but the hopeful elect, the righteous say, damn, we ain't supposed to do that. Okay, well I ain't gonna do that. Damn, okay, cool. I can you know, you ain't supposed to get a line in. You you fucking effeminate sexy niggas. Right. Right. You niggas compete with the women, man. I'm tired of that shit. Yeah, bro. man. You trying to knock the women out. Like, yeah, let the women be a woman, dog. Right. You niggas in the fucking pictures. Oh, I'm telling you, niggas, man. 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 They're going to hell on. They're going to hell on. That's a woman's glory, man. Let the woman be hurt. Hey, you fucking women be women, too. Yeah, you right. women, man. When I was in high school, the bitches wanted a nigga with long hair. Why you want a nigga with more hair than you? Right. <laughs> but, hey, this world, as this world, as shit hit the fan, the world goes back to the default sentence. That's right. All you bitches, right. all you women... You ain't gonna care how a nigga looking that day. Right. You don't care what a nigga wearing that day. Nope. Uh, you ain't gonna care. <laughs> he gonna, he ain't gonna care if a nigga got good hair right. in that day. Right. Right. You gonna just be that? Oh, 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 go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah. Kai. Go, go ahead, bro. <laughs> nah, nah. You ain't gonna be looking for a two hundred thousand dollar making nigga. You know what I'm saying? Right. Going back to the scripture, it says verse. Uh, at the end of verse ten, it says. Prophesy not unto us right things, speak unto us smooth things, prophesy deceit. Look up that word smooth. They want to hear bullshit. They want to hear, they want to hear, sow a seed. They want to hear that shit T.D. Jake's talking about. Joel Osteen. Okay. Uh, uh, what's some other ones? They want to hear that shit they talking about. Hey, hey, if you do what I tell you, you can be like me. That's basically what they're telling them. If you listen to me, you can be like me. Right. You can you can have private jets. You can have a sixteen thousand dollar doll that speak three languages. <laughs> Leroy Thompson said that. <laughs> That's what you niggas want to hear. And just, they're just like, how do the phrase go with women? What do they tell you when you? I remember talking to the old heads. They say when you're dealing with women, tell them what they want to hear. Tell them what they want to hear, man. And the men has become as women too. So you got men right. and women just want to hear bullshit. That's right. They want to be. Why do you think these false pastors is so closely, directly related to pimps? That's right. right. It's like motherfucking jaguars and leopards, a pastor right. and a pimp. That's yep. right. Yep. It, it ain't too many differences between them, man. Yep. Yep. That's right. That says a smooth. It says. Because we ain't prophesying smooth things. Right. We prophesying the straight gate. Right. The straight gate ain't smooth. That's right. The word is straight means position of difficulty. That's right. right so it's gonna be a fucking rocky, tumultuous path, man. Yep. And you follow the man in front of you. You follow the leader, right? Because it's easier to follow in the foot in the footsteps in the footsteps of the snow somebody else than starting your own. Yep. What else it got? It says uh, for smooth. It says. Slippery places or flattery? Oh, flattery! Yep. Oh, 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 grab! Uh, 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 Christ, 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 Christ! CQ twelve. That's the, they love that uh, picture. They love that that name. They are. Yeah. You see? They want to hear what it say. They want to hear smooth things. Let me read it again. One yeah, go ahead, go ahead, brother. It says, "Which say to the seers, see not, and to the prophets, prophesy not unto us right things. Speak unto us smooth things. Prophesy, prophesy deceits." deceits. 
Ezekiel right. 12 and 24. Right. This is Ezekiel chapter 12 and 24. Where there shall be no more any vain visions or flattering deviations. So the Lord's setting all that shit yep. down. Uh -huh. yep. You see the hot water all them niggas in. Yep. That's one of the ways he's shutting all that shit down. <laughs> and how about you look at your life? Oh. You've been serving them niggas and going to them niggas churches. Yep. 20 years, 30 years. You in the same predicament. You need a new washing machine. Yep. <laughs> what motherfucker with money need a new washing machine? Right. <laughs> you need something. Be, right. For there shall be. This no motherfucker wearing a mat. Go ahead. Yeah. Oh. With the windows that. For there shall be no more any vain vision or flattering divination. So the Lord shutting the mouths of all that bullshit, man. Yep. That's all the scripture says. Uh, the poor have hope. When you read Job, the mm -hmm. poor have hope and yep. iniquity stoppeth her mouth. Because yep. that shit y'all talking about ain't working. Yep. And that's what happens. The scripture says when a man's wisdom faileth him, he saith, I am a fool. Because yeah, the shit you believe ain't work for you. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Then, then, then what? If, if you're doing the same thing over and over again and it ain't working, what's that? Insanity. Psycho. Sorry, insanity. Insanity. You're insane, man. That's why they people are like, so you're man, insane to keep running to the Christian church for help. You got Jake still to this day, man. Yeah, I got to start going back to church. No, you fucking don't. You got to be the worst. <laughs> Take some You better off just being you. Outside of this world. So all you got to do is that go get bugged out and still be further from the out by some upside. Yep. Yep. Right. Yeah. Yeah, so I'm gonna... Oh, we're finishing that. Now keep reading on Ezekiel. Yep, I'm sorry. <laughs> That's back to Ezekiel 12. And it says, verse 25, it says, For I am Yahweh Shemel I will speak, and the word that I shall speak shall come to pass. Yeah, those prophecies come to pass, man. Yeah. And we see uproars of the people, and we see earthquakes, Ooh. and we see distress of nations, Ooh. and we see wars and rumors of wars, yep. and we see pestilence, and yep. we see famine, and the famine gonna increase. Oh, yeah. Because what you know you know what's part of famine? Inflation. Right. Inflation go hand in hand with famine. Yep. Your ass ain't even message. Message. <laughs> You ain't even staking eggs like that motherfucker. Right. I remember being young, you know, with, with my father and them, mm -hmm. we going out to eat restaurants, yep. crab legs, like, you know what yep. I'm saying, like the expensive restaurant. Yep. You you ain't doing that shit. Nope. You ain't buying all the Jordans like how you used to. Yep. Hell, you, you can't afford, uh, what, no, uh, uh, grab that in Revelation when it says uh, 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 a denarius, Oh, oh, uh, 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 which is a day's wage? Oh, real quick. That black horse. Yeah, that black horse. I don't know how to spell Denarius. <laughs> uh, I tried it off, but it's 65. It don't, it don't, is that it? Going to it. Yeah, you gonna get the word? Yeah. Going to it. Well, I, I can't get it on here, but you probably can. Yeah, that brother got it. Yeah, yeah Revelation like 6. Five and six. Yep. And it says, the third seal, famine. That's what it says up there at the top, y'all. Yeah. It says, Revelation 6, verse 5 through 6. And it says, And when he opened the third seal, I heard the third beast say, Come and see. And I beheld, and lo, a black horse. And he that sat on him had a pair of balances in his hand. And I heard him for See, this place ain't balanced, man. Yep. This place this, this place ain't the, the scales is tipped in the favor of the super wealthy, super elite. Mm -hmm. Go John. ahead. Yep. And I heard a voice in the midst of the four beasts say, A measure of wheat for a penny. Right, because that's what you use a scale for, for a measure. So what what's the weight of your dollar? A measure of wheat for a penny. Yeah. Go ahead. And a measure of wheat for a penny. And three measures of barley for a penny. And see thou hurt not the oil in the wine. So while this inflation going on, leading into his famine, don't hurt the oil in the wine because that represents the truth. The truth's still out here. Yep. So what we're going to, you got the word? Yep. What word is it? It's a denarius. 
Did he read? Did you read the narrative yet? No, it's yeah, because it comes out as a penny. Penny, penny, penny is, sorry, yeah, it's like a yeah, yeah, yeah. So that penny is a, a, a denarii, which is the denarius. This is a Roman silver coin in the New Testament time. And this is Rome all over again. Y'all yep. yep. niggas, the Romans. Come on, bro. We should we shouldn't have to go in there. Right. This is Rome. You got Roman numerals in the books in the textbooks. All right. That was the, the, the Edomite power structure where they ran the whole world. So this is Rome 2.0. You so-called white people run the whole world. Hell, the, the, the Treaty of Rome, y'all yeah. revived the Roman Empire. Those are quotes that were said from people that wrote the treaty. The spirit made them say that. Yep. Go ahead. It said it took its name from it being equal to ten asses. Ten donkeys. Man. You know how much a, a donkey? Ooh. A, be, a, a beast of burden. Yep. So you uh, uh, go ahead. The number after two seventeen BC increased to sixteen. He said it was the principal silver coin of the Roman Empire. From the parable of the laborers in the vineyard, it would seem that a denarius was then the ordinary pay for a day's wage. A day's wage. Yep. So to get some fucking bread, what's what? The, the, let, let's say you make twenty. Let's say you make twenty odd some dollars an hour. You say you make a $200 a day. So $200 a day is going to get you what? Some bread. Yep. <laughs> That's inflation, man. Uh, hyperinflation. That's hyperinflation. And hyperinflation is when the, the shit just continues. Yep. Yep. It continues. Yep. It might be, it's going to start out as a day's wage. Then it's two days wage. Yep. Then it's three days wage. Now you gotta balance it out. Yeah, all you people out here, y'all are fucking fat. Yep. This is the only time in history where the poor outweigh the rich. Yep. You fucking fat. Yep. A lot of you. You fucking fat. Y'all gonna get that six pack though real soon. Yep. Real soon. <laughs> y'all get that fucking six pack. Yeah. Are you gonna? Are somebody gonna yeah. eat your ass? Yep. No, you gonna, you gonna find gonna out? Be... <laughs> you gonna find out that six pack was just in the back of the fridge? Y'all these old fucking. <laughs> Snickerdoodle ice cream bread eating fat bitches. Yep. You ain't thick, you fat bitch. Yep. Yep. Morbidly obese. Yep. Fucking starch. All you fucking like macaroni and cheese. Yeah. Candy and potatoes. Yep. You yep. fucking bitches fat. Man, women, women never outweigh men. Yep. Women never outweigh men. You fucking women outweigh men. Yep. Fucking fat. Go ahead. Oh, you got that? No, I want. Oh, yeah. Alright. That was it on that. Alright, go back to second chapter. No, I grab. I grab one real quick. This is the All book. Because right. I've been looking for that uh, four sword judgments, man. Because that's what the Lord about to drink in, bro. Yeah. Hey, that's what the Lord about to bring, man. The Lord said he could bring four sword judgments. And, uh, yeah, the brother's speaking on famine, and he's talking about these people being overweight and everything, obese. Hey, that's against the law also, man. <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh, you know, uh, being gluttonous, uh, you know, uh, you know, one thing I think about that famine, I think you big people about to get ate. Either you go get ate, you go get skinny, and you go be eating other people. Okay. No matter what, man. This is the book of that that spirit. Get in my belly. Get in uh, my belly. Yeah, man. Yeah, from Austin, man. <laughs> yeah. This is uh I want to grab this in the book of Ezekiel. And I'll start here. In 20 it says for the 14, Lord, 14 and 20. Uh, Ezekiel 14 and 20. It's like Though Noah, Daniel and Job were in it as I live, saith the Lord power they shall deliver neither son nor daughter. They shall but deliver their own souls by their righteousness. And that's what we're trying to do, uh, trying to uh, make our uh, bodies live and sacrifice, Lord willing, uh, we be a part of that number, man. It says, for thus saith the Lord power. Here's the point. How much more when I send my four sword judgments upon Jerusalem, the sword and the famine and the noisome beast and the pestilence to cut off from it man and beast. So the Lord going to send a famine out here. Hey, these wild animals going to change places. Bears in your backyard. Lions and tigers and bears. Oh, oh my. Yeah. Hey, yeah. hey, it's about to get crazy out here. 
different uh different beasts, different animals, shit you ain't never seen before. The Lord got things uh planned out for this place, man. Okay, he got he got a bunch of good plans, and we're gonna be mocking when your fear coming. We're gonna be happy, you're gonna be laughing, oh look at that, you know, when your fear cometh, man, and the Lord's gonna be happy too. Okay? So that famine gonna hit really hard, man. You know, you already got women uh putting their babies in freezers and shit. Yeah. Uh you got women and men killing their children. Hey, the children don't have a man. Children are praying in this the place. The children are yeah. praying in this place, man. Well, they need yeah. the Lord. The children need the Lord. Yeah. You damn crackers are fucking them up in the school system. Your school system is out of whack. Mm -hmm. Hey, you can't teach nobody nothing. Okay, your school system's out of whack. Your food is fucked up. Yeah. You're tearing the children to pieces, man. Yeah. Pushing homosexuality on them. Yeah. Pushing all these horrible things on the children. Okay? Yeah, you're going to hear it. You're going to hear it over there. Yeah. Okay? But guess what? The Lord's going to avenge those children, man. Yeah. The scriptures tell you the innocent and righteous blood cry upon to me. Uh -huh. All right? Like, like righteous... Abel what, was not Abel. As soon as he hit the dirt, what did he do to the Lord? Yeah, he, he said, "Lord, didn't you see what this nigga did?" Yeah. And that's what we doing right now. Yeah. Okay, don't you see what these damn devils is doing? Yeah. The Lord hearing our prayers. He hearing the voices of us, man. All right, All right? we're complaining against you, damn crackers, man. Yeah. Cause you damn devils and went too damn far. Yeah. All right. And the hurtful works are fulfilled. The hurtful <laughs> works are fulfilled, man. Yeah. Enough is enough. Enough, enough is man. enough. What's that scripture say? Uh, it is time for the old Lord to work. Work. Man, no, let me oh, grab yeah. that. Yeah, I grabbed that. Yeah. <laughs> All right, bro. I'm going to uh, go back to 2nd Ezra chapter 9. Ooh. Verse 5, it says, I'll start at verse 4 again. It says, then shalt thou well understand that the most high spake of those things from the days that were before thee, even from the beginning. That's right. But like as all that is made in the world hath a beginning and an end, and the end is manifest. So that's how we know we're at the end. It's being made known. Yep. This is what happens in the beginning. Everything cool. Yep. Everything straight. Yep. In the middle, what? What? Grab Second Ezra uh, six mm -hmm. and nine. Okay. Yep, Second Ezra six and verse nine, and it reads. For Esau is the end of the world, and Jacob is the beginning of it. Who is Esau? Yep. The so-called white man. Yep. So you're the end of the world. Yep. Now, when you read 2 Ezra, the 11th chapter, the 13th chapter, it says, this is the beast that I've decided to rule in the end of your world. So Esau is rules at the end. Yep. <laughs> but Jacob, Jacob is the beginning of that which followed. Yep. So this devil is on a decline. Yep. Kingdoms and empires have, they have uh, beginnings, highs, and declines, and then they then they translate it to another kingdom. Yep. So Sirach 10 and 8 says, grab that real quick, yep. Yep. Uh, Sirach 10 and 8, because of unrighteous dealings. It's been enough. Yep. It's been enough unrighteous dealings. The hurtful works of unrighteous dealings have been fulfilled. Yep. It's enough unrighteous fucking dealings. Yep. Tree, uh, truce breakers. Yep. Break your treaties. Yep. Go ahead. Injuries. Injuries. Just weighing Jake the fuck out. Yep. Using the medical field to yep. wear him the fuck out. Yep. Outright killing them. Smallpox blankets. How about this? Yep. Do you motherfucking white people? Is George Washington in hell? Watch this dude. Mark. He's gonna come over here and say something. You believe in hell, right? Yeah, let him come over. If you bad, go on and fuck him. We ain't paying no attention to him. I want him. You believe in hell, right? No. You believe if you do bad, God gonna punish you, right? Is George Washington in hell for having slaves? Was slavery okay? Is Thomas Jefferson in hell? Right. Is all these motherfucking forefathers in hell? Right. Yeah. All right then, you oh. the fucking you are hypocrites. Oh, exactly. But they look at us and be like, y'all going to hell. Don't even know. Man. Nigga, hey, nigga, this is hell. But, 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 right. but that's but that's logic though. Right. Dude, okay, let's let's let's, let's use logic. Yeah. Is George Washington hell? He owns oh slavery is bad. Uh, yeah. Black lives matter. Okay. Right. Well, George Washington he lived and died believing a certain way. Is he in hell because of it? Right. You fucking then devils they, don't. They hit you with that. Well, trying to reason. Man, shut the fuck up. Right. Well, they, the, the devil right. can't reason. Right. Not righteously. Nope. Right. 
and riches <laughs> got by the seat. Riches got by the seat. Yep. Fucking thieves. Yep. Save, oh, Habakkuk says, shameful spewing. Yeah, beyond yep. thy glory. Shameful for yeah, you're glorious America. We're the pinnacle of civilization. We're right. the best. We're right. the we're the marker. We're the right. beacon of hope and life. Right. But yeah. how the right. fuck did you get that way? Right. <laughs> you don't fucking move the Native Americans to reservations. Then you find oil on it. Then right. you remove them. So that's riches getting by the seat. Double and triple fold. Right. These fucking white people walking around like they so great. You just a fucking thief, yeah. and you suck. Yeah. <laughs> you can't get it. You know you up. fucking suck. Right. They know they suck. Yeah. They know you know you <laughs> suck, bro. Right. Precept. <laughs> you know that they know, bro. They, that's why they that's why they hate the Israelites so bad. Because yeah. because when they come to the other heathens, yeah. they're like, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm okay, okay. I, yeah. I, you know. Yeah. Right. But then when they come, it's like, fuck, I just can't. God damn. damn. You got niggas growing and, up. Yeah, yeah. And they, they make it look so easy. They make it look okay, so easy. I'll be at the fucking job, running back and forth, doing laps. I'm in there chilling, <laughs> doing the same shit, getting everything done with no stress. These right. <laughs> motherfuckers <laughs> running up and down the steps and all kinds of shit. A nigga grew up, a nigga grew up eating hot Cheetos, <laughs> fucking bologna sandwiches, nigga running a 4-1. Right. Fucking highest IQ. Hey, how you doing? Hi. Oh, you want to know, man. You was you an SW day. You're a social justice warrior, ain't you? I mean, I hope so. I know, I know. How you doing? What's I your name? So. What's your name? I oh. voted. Did you? That's a nice sweat. Thank you. <laughs> what, what made you come over here? Y'all we was loud. <laughs> <laughs> you believe in the Bible? Uh, nope. Is it yes or no? Is it yes or no? Do I believe that the Bible exists? No, do you believe that it is something to follow and it is real and it is, it's up here and everything goes down there? Well, there's a lot in the Bible. So one of the things that I I heard that Jesus said in the Bible was that um, every time you clothed someone who needed it, every time you fed somebody who needed it, you did that for me. Okay. I love that shit. What that, don't you like? That's, that's right up there. What don't you what like? What don't I like? Um, he shall not suffer a witch to live. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you like that? Because I have my own relationship with with him, with with him. With who you all, call? Who you with call with God? All that is. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Yeah. And all that is that Creator gave me power. To heal, and I don't believe that. that so you, so you're a witch. Totally. Yeah. What is that? What is America's witch? Wait, well, tell me, tell me, hold on, tell me, tell me, tell me. What does that mean, though? Thou shalt not suffer a witch. To no. Live. What does what does it mean to be a witch? Well, I don't know. I don't know. What does it mean to be a witch? Yeah, that's what he. So, so when he said. Well, well, I will tell you what it means. Grab, grab a, a proverb and a byword. Yeah. We don't tell you exactly what it means to be a black person because black is a color. So actually, when 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 the, when the so-called white man put us in slavery, they called us black to hide our nationality. None of us up here is black. So if somebody I look at us and see black, that's actually racist. I'm not a color. I, I have a I have a nationality. And I go back to a heritage. So you're saying it's more complex than all that? It's more complex than what you was taught. And same with witches, right? Yeah, that's why I asked. I said, what does it mean to be a witch? Yeah. I mean, the only reason I asked that question back to you is because, like, it's it's complex. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, it's like a, a, each person has their different relationship with it. But I think fundamentally what it means is, like, I... Um, it's a mystery, kind of. You know what I mean? It's like I would say it's not a mystery. I, it's complex. It got a lot of angles to it. It's not cut and dry as the average person might look at it, but it has a meaning. Just like calling somebody black is like, what the fuck does that mean? Excuse my Swahili. But what the fuck does that mean? Oh, you're a black person. Black is a color, and when you look at the connotations of black, it means you're not look, grab the definition. Yeah, grab the definition of black, black and read that real quick. Yep. 
This is Deuteronomy chapter 28 and verse 37. It says, shall we, I'm going to read 15 real quick. It's Deuteronomy 28 15. But it shall come to pass if thou wilt not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God. Right, so if these people on these signs don't follow the Bible. To observe, to do all his commandments and the statutes which I have commanded thee this day, that all these curses shall come upon thee and overtake thee. Right, so you're going to be cursed. You're gonna be at the you're gonna have broken homes. You're gonna be on drugs. You're gonna kill each other. You're gonna be a statistic because you didn't follow these laws, statutes, and commandments. Yep. Go ahead. And this is one of the curses. Verse thirty-seven. And thou shalt become an astonishment. Okay. Well, somebody look at you and just oh my god, yep. they, they live like this. You have so-called white people that come to the hood in the ghettos and just fucking go on the field trip. They just take pictures like oh my, they can't believe like people live like that. That's an astonishment. Go ahead. It says a proverb and a bride. Now, what's a proverb? It's a wife is not you, but so-called white people. A lot of them, they have a lot of sayings about our people. A yeah. proverb is an uh, enigmatic saying. Can I ask a question? Oh, uh, real quick, I'll let you ask a question. But let me finish breaking that yes. verse down. It says, "Thou shalt become a proverb." Yep. What's yep. a proverb? An enigmatic saying. Mm -hmm. What's an enigmatic saying? That means that it's not straightforward. Where does the black man keep his uh, paycheck? Well, what is what's one of them? Uh, where does a black uh, man keep his welfare check? Uh, in his work, work book. Group. Yeah, work book. Yeah. Well, well, well uh, black people are lazy. Yep. Black people just like to have sex in the, and, yep. and, and do drugs. Yep. All these different things yep. that they know us as, and they use their media to for it. Yep. But when you look at the 40s and the 30s and the 50s, right. we was what you saw: so-called black men and women in business suits fighting to read. Fighting to be educated, but 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 we had television, so they couldn't just show that. So no, then you got the black exploitation field. Let me let me the actual the so-called white man J Edgar Hoover. Let me use our resources and our sciences to devolve these people into believing that uh, 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 hypersexuality is the way to go. Let me let me let me get them to look up to drug dealers. That's why you look at the music when you look at we. Before we had the Temptations, we had the Supremes, we had uh, 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 guys, people before that. But now we got bitches and hoes and drugs. But when you look at who owned all those music companies, the so-called white man. Now keep reading. It says a proverb and a byword. And a byword. Now look up the definition of byword. Byword means something that you are not. So if somebody called me a black person, that's something that I am not. I am not a color. If somebody called me an African American, that's something that I am not. The word Africa comes from a Roman general named Leo Scipius Africanus. So he conquered the land of Africa, and then they called, and then that, that's how white people do. You go over, you conquer something, and you name it after yourselves. Ameri America comes from an Italian map maker named what? Do you know? Amerigo Vespucci. So how can I be an Af so how can I be an African American? Every 20 years, our identity changed yep. because they don't want to, they don't want the world to know that we the Jews. Yep. So, you're gonna we'll one second. I got, you still got a question. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we break it down. But read uh, the definition of black real quick. This is the word black. It's a conspiracy. Yep. The, the idea of blackness. Everything regarding those people on those signs, it's a conspiracy. It's a conspiracy. Read the definition of black. But what happens is, you tell a lie for so long, it just become a part of society. Right. And no one questions it. Yeah, they try to say other related to black people, but we... No, no, get, in the ed get them in the etymology. Oh, yeah. You know what etymology means? Get them in the etymology. That's why, and, and another thing, they changed the... De they changed what, You know what nice meant? You know what the word nice meant in the 1800s? It meant regular. It meant um, the, we we say nice like oh my god you're nice. Right. Nice didn't mean that in this in its origin. So every so often they change the meaning of words. But one of the original reasons of black was uh, evil without light. That's in here too. Go ahead, read it. That's the bottom. It says characterized by the absence of light. The absence of light. Go ahead. Reflecting or transmitting little or no light. Uh, Wicked. Wicked. Uh, so, so, so there's a lot of, you just said witchcraft, right? Well, there's something called word magic. You know about word magic, right? You use, you, 
because you invoke, we, we speak, right? When you when you talk, it's, it's, it's vibrations, it's it's energy. So here it is. You got you got us you got us cursing ourselves, calling us we a black person. No, we're not wicked. Right. That's why. That's why when when the so-called black person commit a crime, it's oh my God. Well, he's 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 bad. He's a bad guy. But when the so-called white person shoot up a school, what do they say? He's oh, he was he was he was he was a bu- he was bullied. Oh, he didn't he didn't get any attention at home. See, that's wordplay because white the word white means to be morally yeah. pure and righteous. Yeah. So white people, so called white people, they're not that color. What color am I? Is it is it is it white? Would you say it's the color? Nope. Exactly. Okay. Really, really, so called white people. Grab Genesis twenty five. Get Esau eating. Really, so called white people, they are a derivative of red. Because if, I, if 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 you get, smack them on the neck, red neck, right? It's, you you in the sun, it's too hot. You're red. When you when you get flushed with when you blush, you're red. That's what so what so called white people are actually a derivative of the color of red. Go ahead, read about Esau. This, uh, this is uh, Genesis 25. I'll start at verse uh, 21. It says. And Isaac entreated the Lord for his wife. One thing you, one thing that we must understand that every nation on earth existed in the Bible. See, we there's this, there's this, there's this notion that um, if somebody do believe in the Bible, they believe that everybody just mixed and there's no original nations. No, because the seed, your nationality is determined by your father. Even back in, even back in uh, 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 racist colonial America, they knew that. They had something called the grandfather clause. Your grandfather was a slave, then that that trickled down unto you. They knew that who your father was determined who you are. Go ahead. It says in Genesis 25 and 21, And Isaac entreated the Lord for his wife because she was barren. And the Lord was entreated of him, and Rebekah, his wife, conceived. And the children struggled together within her. So it was a difficult pregnancy, but why is this pregnancy so difficult when I prayed to be pregnant? Go ahead. And she said, if it be so, why am I thus? If you grant my prayer, then why am I fucked up? Part of my Swahili. Go ahead. And she went to inquire of the Lord, and the Lord said unto her, two nations are in thy womb. So they twins. They twins. They twins. But why are they not the same nation? Right. There's two nations. Go ahead. And two manner of people shall be separated from thy vow. So so-called black people, is, that is the origin of so-called black people and so-called white people, according to the Bible. Go ahead. And the one people shall be stronger than the other people. Which, these people on this side stronger than so-called white people. Mm-hmm. You have something called the Giselle schedule, when that's when they judge the strength and the intelligence of babies. Now, so-called black people are six months ahead of so-called white people. That's why it's imperative for Margaret Sanger to put Planned Parenthood in black communities. They put fucking vaccines in the so-called black communities. They're trying to level the playing field. Now, you as a regular individual, you might have some sort of, you don't you don't understand that, but you're the higher elites of your race, they understand and know that. Go ahead. And it says, What's my, but wait, are you and I not the same race? Read, read it again. Yep. So you have, you have, okay, well, 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 let's use modern, you have the human race, right? You have the human race. We can say that, right? You agree? But you and I are the same. Okay, but, but now you branch off. Right. You got fruits, right? But every fruit is not a peach. Every fruit is not an apple. So you have distinctions. Yep. That's why I said, read that part again. Right. Two manner of people shall well, be yep. separate. Go ahead. Genesis 25 and 23. And the Lord said unto her, two nations are in thy womb. Yep. Like two nations Yep. That's already a separation without a doubt. And then said what? In two manner of people. So they're not even gonna be the same. They're not even gonna act the same. We have different mannerisms. Yeah. How, the, how do you not interpret that as men and women? Well, hold on. Well you're about to write, keep reading. get into it more. It says in the one Because it's but one thing right. because it says there's not a nation. Right. Nations are made up of men and women. Because yeah. yeah. it right. said two nations. Right. Nations are made up of men and women. Right. Go ahead. It says shall be separated from thy vows, and the one people shall be stronger than the other people. We stronger, everybody know that. Yep. We dominate every field every that shows strength. Yep. Even, the, now, now they always conceded um, the, the physical, right? right. Yeah. The so-called white people, they always gave us that. Yeah. But we also have the more mental strength, too. Yep. You have something called neuromelanin, yep. which melanin is a substance 
which helps you operate in the earth. You have it. You have you melanin, which affects your hair. Yep. You have uh, uh, that's why so-called white people have blue eyes, green eyes, color eyes. They like melanin. That's why they see better at night than than in the daytime. Can I ask you your name? Kaya. 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 Yeah. I'm back. I, have to I like you, man. Go ahead, go, go ahead. <laughs> go ahead. It's a lot. Look, listen, man. it's a lot. I know, we know it's a lot. It's I a just, lot. I just was curious what. what man, you kind of cute too, a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Get your ass out of here, man. <laughs> no, go ahead. <laughs> go ahead, man. <laughs> I am just, you know, I just whatever way. This, Who you vote for? Whatever way this yeah, Madam President. Madam President. Okay. 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 And I do you are you a Bernie fan? Are you a Bernie fan? I'm a fan of truth. Right. The there's guy, some things I like, there's a lot of things I don't like. Are you a fan of the guy who's who like goes and protests at McDonald's to get people to have higher wages? He's a he's a, It's a movie. I know, I know. It's not real. Yeah, everything's true. It's not real. It's not real, Meg. <laughs> That's what we believe, Meg. Matrix, Meg. It's the, it's the <laughs> matrix, Meg. It's the matrix. President presidents are selected, there, not elected. It's the matrix, Meg. That's what we believe. So, whichever way this swings, these people, every individual you see walking down the street yeah we have to come together no, 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 but let me, let me, let me interrupt, let me interrupt. No, 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 make, 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 because it's our platform, it's our platform, man, it's our platform. I'll give it back to you, but let me interrupt. Now we got to come together, and I, I'm not saying you don't feel like this, but I'm saying like the conglomerate. Yeah. Now we got to, we didn't have to come together in the 50s. No. We had to come together in the 60s, but now when, 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 when so-called white people facing the pain and anguish that we face, now it's time to come together. It don't work like that. Nope. It don't work like that, Meg. You don't, you don't get to have all the fun, and then, then when the fun's no longer happening, then you get to say, sorry, let's come together. Yeah, sorry, let's come together. You know sorry. Yeah, you know, the 50s. I'm talking about, like, I'm talking about me and my Trumper brother have to come together. I'm talking about you and Get Matthew 10, well, hey, Matthew the vision. Yeah, 10, yeah, that was about okay, the, well, the so, Lord's about the vision. So what I'm saying is that we are being divided by identity politics. I have a strong, you know, each individual is being made to feel very, very strongly about their identity, and it is easy to... War, put us at war against each other. Well, war is so physical. We're we're not we're not we, us. Okay, no, it's you're, not. Meg, you're it's, right. You're right. You're, mental. You're mental you're, physical. you're right to a degree. So I'm not going to take that away but from I'm you. Not finished. Okay, but man, I'm gonna, I'm gonna interject. I said I'm gonna get back to you. Read that real quick, yep. and then when we gonna break that, then we are gonna give it back to yep. Meg. Go ahead. Right, Meg. This 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 is from y'all called Jesus. Is it Megan? Is it Megan? No, it's Meg. Just Meg. Just one song. Uh, Just right, one. Right. God damn. Go ahead. At least right. I got two. No, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Right. This is Matthew chapter 10 and verse 34. Uh, Matthew 10 and Now I want the suppose ye. Is that suppose ye? No, go ahead. No, Wait, no, it, don't says, it don't matter. It don't matter. Yeah. This is thank not that I have come to send peace on earth. That's not. That's words in red. That's yep. who the world calls Jesus. Yep. There's, a, there's a false notion of who he actually is. Because his, his, his character is taught through the tradition of the Christian institution. But he said, think not that I have come to send peace on earth. Go ahead. I came not to send peace, but a sword. Go ahead. For I have come to send a man at variance. What does variance mean? Opposition. I've come to send a man what? At variance against his father. Uh -huh. And the daughter against uh -huh. her mother. And the daughter-in-law against her mother-in-law. And a man's foes shall be they of his own household. So the division you see in the world right now was prophesied. So that's something else you don't agree with. <laughs> shall not separate where you live, and that hey, that's another. Oh, it's a lot. It's a lot you're not gonna like, man. <laughs> My dad was a priest, so I know this stuff. Yeah. And um, well, sir, what you're saying is, man, so how you feel about this? Is prophecy, well, hold on, hold on. It's undeniable. Yeah, you in the wait, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Her dad was a priest, Salakia. So like yeah, Her dad was a priest. 
So what you feel about all those priests uh, uh, molesting those uh, those uh, infants? Well, he wasn't a Catholic priest, but how do I? I only know I only know Catholic priest. What's another type of priest? He was a preacher. Episcopalian. He was Episcopalian. Episcopalian. Okay. Like so they had a body of elders. My dad was at once um, and still is my one of my favorite people. How do you feel? About, how did how do you feel about you being homosexual? How did you know? You special. <laughs> 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 hey, and with that, <laughs> it's nice talking no, to you, man. No, he, it's a good discourse. Uh, he, he loves me. He loves me and whoever I love. Um, okay. But he was also incredibly abusive. Okay. All of these things exist in every individual. I believe even Jesus. Okay. So the Jesus I follow is the guy that's like, yo, you got. You got people without shoes. You want to give them a, a little bit of help? That's it. That's fucking it, man. Feed them, clothe them, love them. That's it. That's and if they're doing wrong, about. if somebody's doing something wrong, you got to correct them too, right? You to help them and love them, and they have their own. But I'm saying about the correction, though, because you got a, you got you a lot know. of... You don't know. You yeah, could oh, think that somebody's hey, doing something I got wrong. For you. That's true. Go ahead. Go ahead. Let me bring uh, that up. Real quick. This is this is nice this is this nice discourse. Yeah, check this out. <laughs> oh man! <laughs> yeah, man. I don't remember you, man. <laughs> this is Proverbs twenty-seven and five. Open rebuke is better than secret love. Right, so it's better to, to tell oh, your brother man. or your sister where they're going listen off at. And of course, we tell you because <laughs> open rebuke is love. better than secret love. So if I'm openly rebuking you, telling you, hey, you shouldn't do X, Y, and Z, right? According to the scriptures, of course. Because what's sin? Don't don't smoke crack. Right. Because <laughs> right. what's sin? You know what sin is, man? Her daddy a priest. She better yeah, know. You better know. You better know. Because that means he don't know. I'm calling. I uh, I love the, <laughs> we call the Israeli um, version of sin or the translation of sin as missing the mark. That's why. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's a roundabout way. All right. But a more direct. What is that? First John two. Got you real quick. Yeah, go ahead. This is first John three and four. Because the Christian knows who said the law was done away with. Mm -hmm. But first John, that's a book in the New Testament. So right. right. First John three and four. Whosoever committed sin transgresses also the law. For sin is the transgression of the law. Yeah, you broke the law. You broke the law. Holy men inspired by God. Go, grab first, uh, grab second Peter one and two. Look, see this Bible. Look, look. Everybody wrote everything, right? Yeah. Who wrote the Pythagorean theorem? Right. Pythagoras. Uh. Who wrote the fucking quadratic formula? Right. Who wrote all these different? Who wrote all these mathematical <laughs> equations we need to build structures and buildings? Yep. Right. So, so everything is recorded, so we can have a reference. No, the Bible is the, the word math comes from the word amah, which means truth. Yep. Math is just right. truth. But, but, but a law, if you, if you, but a law that, that, that prevents me from walking across the street here rather than over there, that's not math. That's man's law. That's We're talking right. about that's God's law. law. We're talking about, about God's, God's law. law. Yeah. So, yeah. so God told you, God told you not to eat pork. So you eat pork and you get hypertension and you get diabetes right. and you get a you get a parasite called trichoma 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 what is it trichomonosis where it go to your fucking brain and come right. out your eyes. That's math. Right. Don't do that. And what happens when I wear mixed threads and when you wear mixed what, it does oh, yeah, is, what it does is your, your body has a, 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 a field when, when you wear 100% wool and 100%, when you wear 100% wool, that raises your field to 1,000. When you wear 100% cotton, that raises your field to 100. When you wear mixed fields, you have the same, when you wear mixed threads, you have the same field as a dead body. Yep. And that's math. Yep. And you can go, and you can go and Google that. Yep. So then you ain't got to take my words. So where do y'all get your clothes? We don't even curse him. That's when you, that's when, that's what, listen, right, listen, listen, right. listen, 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 no, 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 because this is perfect. Yeah. Man's yeah. father was a priest. Yeah. That's where grace come in, right. man. Right. That's where grace come right. in, God damn it. Right. Because what is grace? Yeah. It's a, it's a, it's a, grace is a time period to pay back the day. Yeah. So grace is when, when the, look, first of all, how many, how many uh, so-called black people you know 
that sell affordable clothing that we can afford. You know how expensive it is to wear 100% wool and 100% yeah. cotton all the time? But who made it that expensive? Because clothing in the 30s and 40s used to be like that. So who made who made that clothing that expensive? The 1%. And what race are the 1%? Uh, the majority. How many of these people? How many of those people? 1%. What race are they? How many of those people are probably? I'll answer this. Go ahead. If you'll listen. The 1%. What race are they? Yeah. The 1%. That's uh, not. 1% uh, is a number. It's not a race. Yeah. And black is a color, not a race. Exactly. Right? So it's arbitrary either way you slice it. No, 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 no. Me, if you had to pick. Me, if you had to pick. The 1% and the 99% are two races. But are, are, are any of these people part of the 1%? I don't know. I haven't read this. What you think though? <laughs> just give me just give me an opinion. No, I don't think any of those any no, not that I know. So when you so in your mind when you say one percent, you don't think Yeah, who do you exactly. think they're white people? Megs are good. Give me a round of applause. Oh, right, <laughs> they are white people. Right. And what and, and, and what branch of white people? What branch? Uh who do we send millions and billions of dollars to? The alien billionaire branch that needs to go to Mars. So the rest of the planet. No, you don't. You don't get to fuck up the Earth and go to Mars. All right, man. Better get out of here before you become a hetero. Better get out of here, man. Oh shit. Oh man. Okay. 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 Her bubble just got burst a little, a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She thought she was going to come over here and well, politics with, the, with the black people. Yeah. Yeah. She got a Black Lives Matter shirt yeah. somewhere in the car. Right. You see those men, they, 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 didn't want to, they had to send a female up. She, she oh, got a big yeah. Oh, she was with them? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, oh, oh. Those guys didn't want to come. Yeah. Hey, that's what's up, though, man. A little, you know, hey, hey. edification, man. Yeah. You know, but see, these devils got to know who the fuck they are. Oh, they are, yeah. You're not the fucking the grab Isaiah 32. No. You fuck. You can start. You can start at the top. You fucking devils. Yeah. And they, they've been they've been deceived to thinking that they're the, the righteous people of the earth. Yeah. Right. They school test systems and everything. Oh, you don't score this. And everything yeah. that they do is just, just ridiculous. Yeah. So Isaiah 32 and one. It says, "Behold, a king shall reign in righteousness." Yeah, I was shy. Go ahead. Right. And princes shall rule in judgment. It's good. See, because the princes, the current princes ain't ruling in proper judgment. So eventually that's going to happen. Go ahead. And it's going to be the Israelites. Go ahead. So far, Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, how you doing? Go ahead. God. That was me. That was me. Yeah. <laughs> it says, and a man shall be as a hiding place from the wind. Yeah, the uh -huh. wind coming. Yep. Those fucking forceful winds is coming, and what's gonna protect you from that? The uh, yep. man of the Lord. That's right. Yep. You That's right. Said it. Yep. That's it. And it covered from the tempest. A covert mm -hmm. is a is a, a shelter. Mm -hmm. as, Go ahead. as rivers of water in a dry place, yep. as the shadow of a great rock in a weary land. So the Lord giving you an analogies. Mm -hmm. When your ass in a you in a Sahara desert and it's hot as hell, yep. a man gonna be a big ass rock that give you shade. Uh, a man gonna be that fresh water uh, when you when you famish uh, because you need water. Go ahead. Right. And the eyes of them that see shall not be dim. And that's the that's the whom the, whom the, whom the eyes of the, that the Lord opened. The Lord opened his men's eyes, man. Mm -hmm. right. See these people, their eyes dim. They don't know what the fuck going on. Yep. They are walking <laughs> up and down the street. The fucking the the, the, the car full of bitches earlier. Who yeah, was looking? They rode past two times, I think. Yeah. I could have sworn I seen them again. Yeah, they eyes dim. They don't know what's going on. Go ahead. It says, And the eyes of them that see shall not be dim, and the ears of them that hear shall hearken. Yeah, so those that listen, they're going to pay attention. Right? They're going to see what's being said, and they're going to be like, Damn, that's what I got to do. The Lord going to do something in their mind where they're going to understand that serving the Lord is the way. To, to, to get out of this hell. Yep. It's the yep. way to live in this hell. Yep. Go ahead. And it says, the heart also of the rash shall understand knowledge. Yeah, so we was rash at one point, mm -hmm. right? But then the Lord said, we don't understand knowledge. Go ahead. And the tongue of stammerers shall be ready to speak plainly. And we speak plainly. The see, we ain't coming to the... the, 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 the the atacutical, right. the excommunical, right. 
Right. All them fucking goofy, big ass words. Right. Well, sometimes you need words yes, to compare yes. a point. But Esau Edom, they fucking had your ass lost in words. Word right. salad. Right. No, we speak plainly. Yep. That's a devil. Yeah. Big shoe, yeah. goofy walk. Yeah. Go ahead. He owned half the town. That's the, that's the look. <laughs> and he owned half the town. That's yeah, the town. him. Yeah, that nigga in charge. Yeah. Yeah. He don't want to do nothing. <laughs> he don't do nothing but fucking lick cats. Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. It says verse 5, the vile person shall be no more called liberal. Yeah, you damn devils, you so-called yeah. white people are vile. Yeah. What's what's a, what's a common stereotype known about white people that they have sex with animals? Yep. Well, you, well, if, if we say bestiality, you don't think of a so-called black man. No, yeah. you think of a fucking so-called white man yeah. and white woman. Yeah. That's what you think of. Yeah. And that's just one example how you vow. Yeah. So we in a day and age now, you the vow person shall know what we call liberal. Yeah. You're not the fucking guy to copy. You're not yeah. Superman. Yeah. No. <laughs> Uh, Superman is a jet. Yep. The sun, the sun strengthened him. He ain't no damn right. old fucking so called white right. right. Go it's, ahead. It says, nor, nor the churl said to be bountiful. Yeah, the fucking churl, wicked, evil. Yep. Y'all been fucking doing wicked and evil shit all along. Yep. But now it's been uncovered. And not everybody pointing a finger at your ass. Yeah. You fucking weirdos. Yeah. <laughs> That's right. It says, it says, for the vile person will speak feelingly. Yeah, you speak wicked shit. Yeah. When you read Psalm 73, yeah. it says they 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 uh they speak they wickedly lost, concerning they oppression. Lost, oppression. Lost, 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 yeah. They speak loftily. Yeah, because yeah, they act like they want us to. Right, they act like we didn't go through shit. Like, well, we didn't really do that. It was really y'all fault. That's they trying to like, like, like find a point like yes. us, like right. we did. It. Yep. Which we did, but they don't know that part. Right. You know what I mean? Because you know we went off against y'all by Shamel Yep. That's why we're in this predicament. But they forwarded that shit. You know yeah. what I'm saying? They led the charge with. It. Uh, yep. It says, "For the vile person will speak villainly, and his heart will work iniquity mm -hmm. to practice hypocrisy." Yeah, to practice hypocrisy, and we see it. Just like Meg, Meg was about to get a, a pocket. Brother Kai ain't yeah, like it, you know what I'm saying? Meg, Meg thinks she's a good. Go ahead, out. Meg, yeah, go ahead. Bro. Wait, hold on. Meg thinks she's a good person out yeah. here in these streets. Yeah, as long as I he really do. No, your ass is through. She so so, and then we all look. We all knew the bitch was a faggot. Right. Yeah, we, I just right. said it. Right. She started yeah. busting at the end like we do. That's fucked her up though. Yeah. How did you know? Bitch, I'm looking at you. Your bitch yeah. is too. Goddamn right. Amar, Amar. It's true. Now we see you. You know what I'm saying? But she now y'all see that though. She was yeah. so, she didn't know that we knew. Yeah. She was weird like that. But it was too. plain as they does. I mean, the bitch like can't buy it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I mean, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Oh, Ryan Secret. Oh, Ryan Secret. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Hey, man was cute back in her day. Yeah, you can tell. Yeah, yeah. 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 Y
to make empty the soul of the hungry. Yeah, and so people want to know what the scriptures is. Following Christianity, your ass don't know what the, you don't even know what the fuck sin is. Right. But your dad was a priest. And well, he should know what you do it on. Yeah, yeah, you hungry. You know, you want to know the truth. You know the scriptures. You follow Esau, eat them. Your ass going to starve to death. Yeah. He ain't going to tell you what's right. As a matter of fact, he trying to get the truth out of the earth. Right. And it says, to make empty the soul of the hungry, and he will cause the drink of the thirsty to fail. Mm -hmm. Yeah, taking down videos. Yep. Yeah, Jake thirsty for the knowledge. Yep. Oh, I'm to take down the video. Yep. Yep. You're doing all type of shit. Yep. Right. The instruments... Also, of the trail are evil. Yeah, the, the, the fucking devices that they got. Mm -hmm. They got all type of fucking devices, man. Uh -huh. And that's what that's why the apostles and the elders, you know, the bishops, different brothers, they always make the distinction. You got your, your regular fucking peon Edomite. Yep. You got your upper elite Edomite. She don't fucking know. Uh -huh. The fucking higher ups, they know and they working. They toiling. Yeah. Uh -huh. They ain't sleeping. They ain't sleeping. Yeah. He devised the wicked devices to destroy the poor. Who the poor? The people on that side. Remember, oh. she said, when I said, who the 1%? I don't see any. And it's she a reason. Right. 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 He devised if wicked devices to So the one percent devising all type of fucking devices yeah. nah. to destroy the, the so-called Negro Latino Native American. That's we right. the poor, man. That's right. Wicked the device He devised wicked devices to destroy the poor with lying words. They even fucking lying! Right. <laughs> they don't give a damn, they just gonna lie. Yeah. Rabbi Finkelstein said, even when we lie, we tell the truth. Right. That's how these <laughs> fucking white crackers think. God. They think whatever the fuck they say, you just gotta fucking accept. That's what it is. That's the standard. Man, uh, man with man. Woman with woman. Right. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense, right? Right. <laughs> it says, even when the needy speak of right. Right. Even when the needy, the poor, the Israelites, so called yep. Negro, I told remember, even when we saying the right shit. Yep. Yep. <laughs> they don't give a damn. That's enough on that, though. <laughs> you know, sometimes you be like, okay, you right. They don't concede at all. Uh, even when, hey, look, we went to the Genesis 25, when the two nations, when I asked you, she got a little dirt. Look up, her eyes went big as hell. <laughs> that's when she's trying to say, well, let me ask this. Thing. That's when they start doing the SC. That's the devil right there. Uh, trying to, well, let me wiggle past all this shit now. Hold on. Look. Hey, I started to say, yeah. I started to say, all right, okay, you're an Edomite. Yeah. Right. Spirit just, yeah. you're an Edomite. Yeah. Yeah. But I ain't yeah. said, though. Right, right, right. You're an Edomite. You know, I can tell. And she's stuck. <laughs> We can really close out. Yeah, this is a... Yeah, go ahead, last one. No, I'm going to nine. Oh, okay, my bad. Nine, go. That's another can of worms. <laughs> no, I... This one, I'm going back to that second last one. I was talking about Isaiah 32 and oh, yeah. Rise up, these women that I need. Right. Yeah. Hey, we got to get on their ass. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, if y'all trying to close, that's what you know. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm going to go ahead and we'll finish up on this one. Back to second answer is nine. Chapter 5, I'm mean, excuse me, chapter 9, verse 5. For, for like as all that is made in the world at the beginning and the end, the end is manifest. Even so, the time also of the highest to have plain beginnings and wonders and powerful works and endings and effects and signs, and everyone that shall. Yeah, this is so the soda, the, 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 the signs. Yeah. All right? Yeah. The works of the Lord ends in effects and signs. Yeah. Remember Egypt? Yeah. It's gonna come a point. See, everything happening now, right? The, 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 the men of the Lord see it. The hopeful believers see it. The hopeful elect see it. But everybody else don't see it. But it's gonna come a point where everybody gonna see it. Yeah. Just like in Egypt, 
when that, that fourth plague of lice, even the even the damn magician said, "This is the finger of God." Yeah. Yeah. Everybody gonna fucking say that at a, at a, at, at, in the future near you. Yeah. Everybody gonna have to attribute it to a higher power, yeah. and not just any higher power, but the God of the Bible. Exactly. We left. What? This is right. What are you laughing at? What the fuck is wrong? Second, all right, this is back to Second Chapter 9, verse 7. And everyone that shall be saved, it shall be able to escape by his works, and by faith, whereby ye have believed, shall be preserved from the said perils. They shall see my salvation. Oh, so it's perils coming. But the Lord said, look, the hopeful believer is going to be preserved, not raptured. Right. You're going to be there, yep. and the Lord is going to make a distinguish that yep. he fuck with you. Yep. Because you ain't, you going to eat. Yep. You going to drink. You going to rejoice. These other people, they going to starve. Yep. They going to thirst. And they going to wail. Yep. And it says, shall be preserved from the said perils, and shall see my salvation in my land. And within my borders, for I have sanctified them for me from the beginning. And that's right. And that's what that the elect of the nation of Israel. All right? Because they were they were set up from the beginning. And that's why we call ourselves what the hopeful man. Because we're hoping to be those the men, you know, that, that were set up from the beginning. All right. All right. So with that, we pray that I was edifying to the elect. We'd like to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahushat, by Hashem, Rakakwadash, double honors to the apostles and the elders of great millstone who rule well. And shalom to sincere hope of life, brothers and sisters listening and learning. And to you, brothers, preaching and teaching the truth through the four corners of the earth. Kwan Yashala. Kwan Yashala. Shalom. Shalom. Fire. Yes, they deserve to die. I hope they burn in hell. Woo! That's how that lesson felt, man. That's how that lesson was. Hey. 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 Hey.